What's going on guys, welcome back to our Metaphor Refantasio playthrough. This is going to be part four. Um, a lot has happened since we last played. Well, no, no, sorry. A lot happened in the last episode when we played. Um, they had the royal, um, the royal, not wedding, the royal funeral for the king that passed away, that got uh, assassinated. And a crap ton happened in there. So I would recommend going to watch that if you guys haven't seen that. Uh, but we're recording this um, while streaming live on Twitch. But I'm going to try my best to ignore chat and just take in the story. Isn't that right, guys? Uh, I think I did everything here last time I had to. Wait, what's view from the window? I can faintly hear the hustle and bustle of the city from beyond the closed shutters. Okay. Um, so I think we're going to sleep. I don't know what the next the next thing we're doing is. But uh, we'll see. Galica, put me to sleep. Can I, can I click on the bed? Wait, what the heck? Wait. <laughs> what the hell? There we go, bed. All right. The bed seems rather stiff, but I can still rest in it. Maybe it's time to call it a night. All right, my voice is also still cooked, by the way, guys, so I do apologize. And right, we're gonna go talk to Moore. So Moore is like the Igor of this game. Really? What exactly do you have against sleep? <laughs> Apparently we've been invited to academia. An ally became a friend, and he awakened to your power. But his path was cut short. It is all too easy to forget the fragility of life, until the tragedy of its loss. Yet, I feel his efforts were not in vain. He never turned from his fears and worries, unflinching to the last. True. Sure. I, lo I love the Grey Sisko. Cool. Old heroes are passed down through their tales. So too will his heart. You have inherited the story of an unsung revolutionary and all its power. Oh, the mag used by Grace has been inherited and returned to Hernia Boy's soul. Wait, can it be warned? Such power rarely awakens without trials. Even should you overcome them, your virtues will be tested time and time again. You must carry on, honing your archetypes and heart with painful sincerity. That is the first step towards changing the world. I have faith in you. All right, Moore. I'm scared Moore's bad. No, just from the weekend, from talking to a lot of people and also um, laughing a lot. I laughed a lot on the weekend and that destroys my voice. Um, archetype experience items. You may come across items that grow your archetypes in various places similar to the hero's incense you receive from Moore. Oh, okay. Right, right, right. Uh, you can use them from the item menu. They grant experience directly to an archetype without having to battle. Ah, forgive me. Oh, it's like rare candies. There's one more important thing. You can visit as long as you have the calm and time to open a book. But when threats lurk nearby, we may not always have the luxury of attention undivided. And danger is an inconvenience so often encountered, of course. As such... A smart-looking fellow, isn't he? There's a special magic igniter embedded in his collar, too. Much as I'd like to join you in person, I cannot. I can, however, send his consciousness oh. in my place. If you see him in places of battle, do stop to pet him, won't you? You'll find him a most helpful companion. Oh, okay. If you would survive the trials to come, think not only of the powers you know, but how they might be combined. Now, until we meet again. Okay. Oh. Uh, hmm. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I thought, it was gonna, I thought it was gonna read it for me. Hmm, something's amiss. Is the spell broken? Has the crystal underground been shattered? No, surely not this quickly. The soldiers couldn't possibly. No matter. No matter. Trivial all of it. More importantly. So this is one of Luis's, like, henchmen. Um, hmm. A rather complicated sealing spell, but it see but I see its workings breaking it will be only a matter of time. So close to the hall of the royal scepter, the plan is near its fruition, and the calamity draws even closer. Oh, okay, so the royal scepter is uh, the scepter that only the king could use. Um, but now they're going to try use it, maybe because the king is, is his spirit is still like lingering, even though he's dead. Um, but they're going to try and use it. And it's basically like a nuke. It's like as powerful as like having a nuke, I think. Time marches on. And the age of a new king draws nearer. 
Is the game loud enough, guys, or do you want the dialogue to be louder? Sorry. I apologize that we've come. I, I apologize that we've commandeered your home. Think nothing of it. This is my fight too. You're going after that man in the cathedral, aren't you? Yeah. Yes. Surely before the day of calamity that is warned about. I don't know what is plotting, but I want nothing more than to foil it. We can't let a tragedy now. We can't let a tragedy that would rob this country of its future come to pass. Not only for the prince, but for Grius as well. One last matter. I am yet unused to this strange power. Un unused. Sorry. I am yet unused to this straight uh, to this strange power. Once we take the field again, I would like to. Uh, I would look to another for orders. Hernia boy, you seem best suited to the task. That is the role you've been serving thus far, right? It'll be all right. No objections here. He's certainly gotten me out of plenty of nasty situations. Okay. I agree. You up for that? Sure thing. I'm the leader. Yeah. I'm leader. All right, got it. Mm. May you lead us in victory. True. I suppose that would make you our captain, Capite. A fitting title for a company's tactical authority, no? Real. I guess, but it sounds so formal. I don't know if I could get used to calling him that. Oh, I actually am captain because I, I have steam stickers and uh, the steam sticker for the main protagonist is captain. As for when we return to the cathedral, yours is the final say, but we'd better be, we, but we'd be better served by prudence than haste. Prudence. Yeah. Right. Let's make sure we're ready for this. Gallica, when it's your time, uh, when it's time to go, give us the word. Yeah, got it. Stay calm, everyone. You can do this. Yo, what's up, Metal Tooth? How you doing, man? Welcome, welcome. We're just playing some Metaphor Re Fantasio. Alright, quest start. Necromancer takedown. Luis's necromancer subordinate must be stopped. I need to discover Luis's whereabouts as well. Who knows what could happen on the day of the prophesized calamity. So, mission periods. A mission with a deadline has begun. Meet up with your allies at the catacombs entrance to challenge the Grand Cathedral. Failure to complete your mission by the deadline will result in a game over. You must defeat the Necromancer before the Day of Calamity. So I have like a few days to prepare. So on a given day, you have time to do one thing in the day and another at night. Dungeons can only be visited during the day and you'll need to rest that night. If you spend time in town during the day, the night is yours. Okay, okay. Have you ever played Persona or anything, Metal Teeth? I'm doing well. I'm glad you're doing good. On the local map, there are icons indicating whether you can hone your royal virtues. Oh, where you can hone your royal virtues, people who have requests, and where your followers are. Raising your vo royal virtues and strengthening your bonds with your followers is the key to obtaining new archetypes. Use your free time wisely and strive to be the best version of yourself. If an action will consume time, the choice will be marked by a clock symbol. Keep this in mind so you can plan your activities accordingly. Ah, oh, okay. Hey, you got a sec? I don't. I, cl I clearly literally don't have a sec after that explanation. I need to go do stuff. I was thinking, isn't Grand Trad just huge? All this running from end to end must be so tough. <gasps> Hoverboard! Oh my god! Grius said that the sword was forged with Magla. With a little magic, I think I can make it float. That's what the prince used to do, remember? So let's give it a try. While in sight there is like cities, press B to hop on your blade and quickly ride through the area. We should go. Dude, farm strawberries? Um, yeah, this game's really cool. It's it's kind of it reminds me of Attack on Titan if you've played uh, if you've watched that anime. Um, but it's a very story heavy game. Yo! Whatever. Go, uh, oi, elder lad, going somewhere? Up to you, of course. But I wouldn't go anywhere near the Grand Cathedral if I were you. Rumor has it that Luis, you know the bloke that has sent his private army to occupy it. Unless you fancy losing your life, I wouldn't get tangled up in that. Bet, bet, bet. All right. Um. Oh, let's see what the Hulkenberg has. I apologize for making you shoulder the burden of captaincy, but if you would have the strength the title demands, I trust you wield it well. So? We cannot leave the Grand Cathedral in its current state. Shall I be off to it then, Hunibai? Uh, I have things to do. Not yet. Okay. So we have... Um, let's have a look at our calendar. Oh, shit. Uh, so through Traveler Voices, you can see how other players spent their time. Okay. So spend time with supporters. Wait, why isn't it loaded at all? This shit hasn't loaded. Am I not online? Oh, wait. Spent time in a labyrinth. Went to the regular cathedral. Went into... Oh. Oh, spent time in town? Oh, you can't actually spend time with supporters right now, probably. Talked with an activist. Talked with a pagan. Heard a story from long ago. I guess I... Let's, let's talk to people. Um, who's this? 
Masked man, greetings, elder boy. We don't see many of your tribe in the royal capital, though we're similar in that way. Have you heard of the Mustari tribe? We too are rarely seen in the Grand Trad. Of course. No, it's understandable. We rarely make ourselves known to the public after all. So then, any interest in our history and why we live our lives secluded and oppressed? I'll share if you'd like to know. Hmm, Musari history. Learning more about them may help us be better support in those, uh, better support those in need, right? I think so. Improve my tolerance. So understanding different cultures and points of view might improve. So basically improve my not being a racist. Is that literally what it is? Improving tolerance? That's going to take some time if you had other plans. No, let's do it. Let's, let, let's be less racist. Pleased to hear it. Glad to hear it. Let's go somewhere to chat, shall we? Well then. Our tribe is called the Mustari. Perhaps the most obvious part of our culture is that we wear masks, just like the one I have on right now. Next, you'll notice we have three eyes. Whoa, three eyes? And that goes for every Mustari. What's it like to see for you all? Our third eye. Cannot see things. We see the world almost exactly as you do. However, the Mustari faith is vastly different, different from that of the tribes. We have our own unique faith, different from the state religion, Sanctism. Uh, is it restricted to the Mustari? Do only Mustari practice this belief? That's correct. Normally we cannot reveal our teachings to other tribes. Sanctism is a belief open to all. Perhaps this is why at times politics get involved and distort its doctrine. For that reason, we refrain from revealing our faith to everyone. It's our only means of keeping the doctrine the way it should be. Interesting. That doesn't sound like the best solution, but I'm guessing it's complicated. Some try to spread our teachings outside the island, but things grow quickly, quickly grow complex, and one must tread carefully. Other tribes have a tendency to jump to conclusions. That is why Sanctism has gathered many believers. And now we are scorned as the masked tribe. That is who we are forever forever etched in our history sorry he taught me about the Masari way of life i feel like my uh i feel like i feel learning more about their existence to improve my tolerance right. inflexible okay so these are all our stats right now so talking to more sorry okay we have courage like there isn't persona so i'm craven i'm a bitch wisdom i'm a dumbass uh tolerance i'm a racist uh eloquence I, I can't talk for shit. I have an Australian accent. And then imagination, I'm fucking, I, I'm uh, like, I, I don't know. I didn't even know what that would be. I'm not SpongeBob. What's up, Avion? What's good, what's good? I hear a voice. Thy present glory comes from one of the splendid virtues already dwelling with thee. This glow serves thee best as a kindling to the flame to the... This glow serves thee best as the kindling to inflame thy followers' trust in thee. Gather the royal virtues and fulfill thy destiny. Pleased to hear it. It may be worth telling you more. Next time I'll tell you about our basic doctrine if the chance comes. Uh, Darth Day Jackson with the follow, man. Appreciate it. Your character is measured by five royal virtues, each of which can be increased in various ways. Holding the royal virtues, courage, wisdom, tolerance, eloquence, and imagination will help you solve your followers' problems and improve your relationships with them. You might improve your virtues by working, aiding people, or testing your courage. Try talking with Gallica for ideas. She knows a lot about the town and can give you more information. Hearing all that was intriguing. It's about time I head back to the inn. So it's night time now. Can I riz up uh, Grius's wife? Can I raise up the widow? On days you don't visit a dungeon, you'll have enough energy left for activities at night. You can visit followers that are only available at night or hone your royal virtues. Okay. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, Spongebob had a lot of imagination, no, right? Um, it seems I can't spend any times with, uh, with followers, but let's see. Regular customer. The only thing that could brighten up times like this would be seeing the smile of an innocent child. Just look at Maria. It's so sad, I can't bear to look at her. Things like this is hard to cope with, even for adults. If you can help us, Hello? Parabris Regular. Well, if it ain't one of Grius' chums, I have to tell you, it was a real shame what happened to him. But don't you worry, friend. Everyone around here owed that man a great deal. I've got no clue what your situation is, but I won't turn you into the authorities. I appreciate you not turning me into the authorities because of my race. Uh, I've got some secrets of my own too, to be honest. Everyone here does too. Yeah. Alright, I'm in love with you, Fabienne. We always get good food. We always get a flood of guests at night. Looks like it's going to be another hectic one. If you're free, you could lend me a hand with preparing food. If you'd like to help out, feel free to use the kitchen as you please. And ha if you have the ingredients, I can show you how to make red grass roasted bidou. Bidou. 
Seems like Fabienne's having a hard time. She's done a lot for us, so the least we could do is return the favor and help her out when we can. Oh, tolerance improves as well. Okay, everything makes us not racist. Yeah, we should. Let's help her. You're a big help. I appreciate the help. Now let's get you into the kitchen, shall we? Bet, bet, bet. Next stop is... We've finished, but we finished preparing the fish, so now we just have to put them in a pot. The finishing touch is the addition of fruit as a secret ingredient. I forgot to ask how to prepare it. What should we do? Hide it under the plate? Put it on top? Oh, grate it in and simmer it? I think... Probably grate it in and... Probably grate it. I don't know. The fruit? Putting it on top? That's not... I think it's... In that case. We should grate the fruit in and then let everything cook in the same pot with the fish. I, maybe it was garnish. But yeah, I was thinking they, they want this flavor to soak up. Gallica and I poured our hearts into the preparation. The fish draws in with the aroma of the fresh fruit. Let's serve it to the customer. I knew it! The customer wolfed it down. You're surprisingly good at this, Hernia boy. Thank you! Looks like I did a good job helping out. I feel like my tolerance has improved. Alright. Okay. Oh, and we're making a crown in that in that chart there. Time marches on, right. and the age of a new king draws nearer. How many days do I have, man? Um. That necromancer mentioned a day of calamity. Pretty ominous, but what does that even mean? Luis, Luis's, or, Luis's orders or not, t'was the necromancer who committed those acts of brutality we witnessed at the royal funeral. He undoubtedly prepares more of the same. Right. We're gonna have to put a stop to that corpse-rubbing bastard before that happens. If the state army can't handle him, then it falls on us to do it. The day of calamity we were warned about is just nine days away. We need to stop that necromancer before then. All right, let's, uh... I, I probably should go into a dungeon and start doing stuff, but I do want to, like, boost all my other stuff. I much prefer the dialogue in the game. Um, let me, let me check the map on him. Actually, let's see what everyone else did here. Uh, spend time with supporters. Spend time with Hulkenberg. Okay. Spend time with Maria. Oh, uh, we could actually spend time with Maria. Oh, can I spend time with Shrell? Gah. I know worrying about it won't solve anything, but I can't stop thinking about Grius. Every time I see Maria's room or Fabian's face, I just can't shake the guilt. You can't blame yeah. yourself. You're right. There's much and more to do before we can start feeling sorry for ourselves. We were only beside him a short time, but we risked our lives together. What we learned was invaluable. Knowing that risk, he still became our ally, still took us under his wing. Perhaps I saw something of my late father in him. He was a man who put family first and country a close second, though they looked nothing alike. Still, I mustn't dwell on it. Grius would want us to focus on what's ahead, and he would be right. Valid, valid. Um, let's go to the inn. I'm going to assume Maria is in here, but Maria was the daughter of Grius. Uh, wait, can I hang out with you? I will be responsible for Maria. I assure you I will give her the best care I can. You all need to focus on your own priorities now. Hold on, hold on. Let me, let me go talk to Maria, because I feel like... Maria seems to still be in bed. I hear stifled crying from the back of her room. But now I think it would be best to leave her. How did other people hang out with her? What? How did, how did anyone else hang out with Maria? Maybe at night. Alright. Let's have a look at the map and see... Uh, exploring town. Oh, you can instantly travel. Actually, that makes sense. Recruitment Center, Mag Exchange, Moore's Phantom, Catacombs Entrance. Shit, there's a lot. Oh, open the follow menu? Wait, thank you, Ajax. What now? Oh, okay, hold on. I see. Don't feel anything right now. Hold on, I actually just noticed though. Wait. It said. No, there's a support. Okay, hold on. I see. There's a spend time with question mark. Let, let's just walk around. Let's walk around down here. Oh, wait. What is this exclamation point? Can't see a single oh, what option. shall I do? I cannot buy the medicine that my sick daughter needs. Medicine? Is that expensive? Yes, it is. Or well, to put it more accurately, it costs more than what the Mustari in this city are capable of earning. My daughter won't be long for this world if I can't get my hands on this medicine. What if I buy it? Our mission is still top priority, but it shouldn't take up too much of our time to squeeze in a shopping trip and help them out. You there. 
What? Don't be ridiculous. We Mustari are treated poorly, but the people here hate the Elder even more. I've heard that all the Elder are an anathema to the Sanctists. The medicine can be purchased at the church, but I doubt they'll do business with you. What medicine is it? Well, it's a respiratory medicine called the Breath of Fresh Air. They sell it at St. Fermi's Church. I'm hesitant to get my hopes up, but should you somehow obtain it, please bring it to me. Let's, uh, all right. Pagan's Dilemma, and there's a deadline. Four days left. Okay. And we get, like, some rewards. So the rewards, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Fuck. Summer, uh, time limit expired. Holy crap. This game's gonna be, like, tough to manage everything, especially if we're gonna be traveling between locations. Yeah, it's, uh, I think she just has asthma, right? I think she'll be fine, bro. I think, I think your daughter will be okay. All right, then. Um... Where is uh Sun Sun Lemio Street? 34 Dude, I, I want to, man. I might actually at some point next week, I'm gonna do like a metaphor marathon. I freaking love this game, man. Like I never feel this way about a game where I, I want to read absolutely everything. Let's see what's going on, yeah. Chatty Elder. Oh my, is that a fairy I see? Haha, <laughs> a real fairy. Well I'll be Look, I know I'm rare. But we don't, we don't need to make such a big deal of it. I should explain. My family has something of a history with fairies. As a boy, my parents would even tell me stories about fairies before bed. Would you care for me to tell you one? So you grew up on fairy tales. No wonder you've got fairies on the mind. If I listen to man's, my imagination might improve. Fuck, we could do this. Yeah, let's listen. Let's just see. Imagine that. Getting, a fairy getting to tell a fairy tale to a real fairy. Come, let's find a table at the tavern. There are also logs on the menu where it's not necessarily discussed further in dialogue. Yes, you're so right. Hold on. You're so right. Like, you mean here, right? Dude, I didn't even research about the Mustari tribe. So, the Mustari tribe, a tribe recognizable by a third eye. They don masks and wear culturally significant attire, which, may, uh, which many among other tribes find unsettling. Though their population isn't necessarily low in number, the Mustari are hard to come by, as most live in the Virga Islands archipelago as they believe uh verger 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 island verger island, Virga island archipelago as they believe in a unique faith they are often targets of persecution outside the island denounced as pagans their eye on their forehead is called their third eye capable of perceiving magla which is invisible to the naked eyes of most tribes however how clearly they can see magla depends on the individual for some it's a vague for some it is vague while others can see it more clearly than fairies perceiving even the magla's quality and density Right, um, that's, uh, dude, all of this, like, kind of applies to the real world, like, I, I guess, like, in, in certain ways, like, it's all, yeah, with all that, yeah, oh, wow, Mustard, what's up, us, right, how are you, hello, Mustard, now, the story goes back to my grandfather's grandfather, once, far, far away, there was a village out in the countryside, there was a cave nearby that the villagers prohibited anyone from entering, but one day, my ancestor, who was just a boy then, decided to ha see it for himself, so he defied his elders, your ancestors sound like a handful. It runs in the family. Anyway, sure enough, he ventured deep inside and soon came, soon became swallowed in darkness, hopelessly lost. A handful or not, he was just a boy and his bravery failed him. He sank to his knees in the dark, crying pitifully. But then something bathed in a warm light caused his eye, caught his eye as it approached him. The little light actually spoke saying, pipe down, you can't cry in a place like this. He was shocked. After he got a good look at it, the boy realized it was a fairy pulsing with light. He was so relieved, his tears only magnified. Dude, he was Link. This is Link, man. What the fuck? This is Link. Uh, what is good at dude? Just freaking loving this game. But the fairy couldn't bear it, throwing her arms up and said, if you want to cry so badly, fine, suit yourself. And she left. It wasn't Link. What? What the? But before he knew it, the fairy returned. It was Link. It was Link. Come on, follow me. He's, she said, I'll show you the way. She said, hey, listen. You see, you see, she had sensed the dangerous beast deep in the cave and compassion won the day. She decided to get him safely back to the entrance. Oh, yeah? Huh, I thought the fairy was kind of cruel at first, but I guess she had a good heart. When they arrived at the cave's mouth, the boy, the boy turned to thank the fairy, but she had already disappeared into thin air. Time marched on and he grew into an adult. He visited the cave countless times, hoping to thank her but he never saw her as long as he lived. Oh, but would you look at the time? We'd better pick this up again later. If you'd like to know the ending, I'll be around. 
Oh my dude, come on, bro. I was gripping the story. I was gripped by the story of the mysterious fairy. I feel like my imagination is my imagination is improved. Dude, what if that was what if that was our fairy, man? What if that was fucking what's her name? Joe Fungus. Well, then. It's time to get back to the others. Back to the hushed honeybee. All right. Um. Oh, what's happening? Worried about Maria? I'm just incredulous. Incredulous. Okay, I think we might better spend time with Maria now. She's still in bed. Okay. I guess not. Oops, sorry. Please, if you can help. Yeah. All right. We always get a flood of guests at night. Looks like it's going to be another hectic one. If you're free, okay. Um, that's too bad. Uh, I don't think there's anything else to do here aside from, uh, unless, you know what, in my room, oh, there was someone right behind me. In my room, there might be the option to. That reminds me. Oh, hold on. I see this is a supporter menu. Hold on. Remember that shopkeeper that spoke to you at the Igniter shop? She was so cryptic, I haven't been able to stop thinking about it. But anyway, what's on your mind? Mm. I can go out. Okay, it doesn't look like there's anyone for you to talk to right now. Okay. That reminds me. Town activities. Okay, I can take a break as well. So that's like study. What to pick? Can't see a single good option here. Across from the igniter shop. Okay. Frick, I keep pressing the wrong thing. I doubt it's going to be open. I think it'll probably be closed. Um. Let's go. Whoa, what the fuck happened here? Hey. What's this then? You come to pick on this one. You come to pick this one over too. Hate to tell you, but he's got nothing. Arr. You Is he alright? What? Never seen someone hit by this before? Just look at him. Of course he's not alright. I think somebody I think somebody moves him along during the day. But come night, he's always around these parts, moaning like a ghoul. Waste of sympathy, trying to look out for these types. Not exactly a rare sight in town. That reminds me. Okay. Um Why? Okay, so uh, the igniter shop. This isn't the cathedral, is it? Dude, should I continue this story? Oh, this is her, mommy, mommy, mommy. Ignite a merchant Tess. I remember you, Alda. Seems I was right about you not being a local. I've heard the rumors. My sources suggest you and Grease were working together. How did you know that? I own a magic igniter shop, and I do have my sway. I have some sway with the residents of Sunshade Row. But you needn't worry. I have no intention of turning you in. In exchange for my discretion, though, for lack of a better word, would you be willing to do a job for me? What job? A dangerous one, shall we say? I imagine a colleague of Grius would likely have the skill and discretion required. However, perhaps I'd look I'd better look elsewhere. I didn't realize how young you are on first glance. I'd prefer to work with someone who already understands how the world works to some degree. Oh! This is like this is a uh, oh my god, this is like um No way! She's the Mitsuru of this game? Is she really the Mitsuru? Too much risk otherwise. Don't want your death on my conscience. I have to become a genius. If only I could get my wisdom up. With a retort that demonstrates your royal virtues, you can gain the upper hand and win new supporters. Consider the type of ruler you'd like to become and respond well when someone's question, someone questions your capabilities. This lady owns the igniter shop, right? I bet the pay would be decent. Might be worth taking the job if she's not, uh, if the job's nothing too crazy. At least describe the job. Yeah, okay, so I need two intellect. That's what I'd like to say, but I don't have the wisdom to access the uh, to assess the danger for myself. Farewell. Okay. Right. Uh, hey, just the thought here, but she's not really seeing you, is she? Not that she thinks you're a bad guy, but she's absolutely absolutely defining you by your uh, tribe and age. But if we can get her to see you as an actual person, I feel she'd tell us more. I bet we'd make an impression if we helped other people around the town. Let's see if there's anything we can do for the people here. I bet that it'd help you um, get better at setting yourself apart. I'll gather the information for you. If you're ever unsure, just ask. Okay. Frick, there's a lot to do. The hey there. Don't you think the Nidia have been given an unfortunate lot in life? Our eyes are only slightly different. 
and we'd like to keep to ourselves neat and not like to keep ourselves neat and presentable. Do they have like white eyes? The Clemmer and Rogue are given all the best positions. And the Roussants, well, uh, as well. They just never seem to have difficulty. But when it comes to us, people inexplicably don't like us and say things like, the Nidia can't be trusted. Can't say why though, we haven't done a thing. Well, while they speak ill of the Nidia, I suppose the Elder still get it worse. Aren't you tired of people saying whatever they please about you? You and me both, really. Damn, bro. Racism. Um, let me... I can I get... Can I access my memory? Yeah. Are they going to give us anything about the Nidia? The Nidia, the Nidia. Nope. Okay. Oh, shit. Slave classes, though. Oh That's definitely us, right? People... A class of people considered so low across the kingdom, no one can be born into it. Rather, it is a restriction on... Wait, what the fuck? What the fuck? Yo, I think Discord is bugging. How so? How so? How so? How you going, Stoop? Oh, like, am I, is, is my, like, Discord channel getting hacked? Wait, let's see. That could be a thing. No, I think I'm already chilling. Am I getting free games right now on Discord? Weekend reference? Oh my god. Oh my god. Did we talk about that? Did we talk- Wait, you mean- You mean when I got really angry at Shady? Did we- Wait, dude, I didn't fucking even remember that. Stu, I actually forgot I saw you. <laughs> now I'm remembering though. Now I'm remembering. Dude, that's so fucking funny. How you doing, bro? Hope you had a good rest of your time in Melbourne. Um, so hold on, slave classes. A class of people considered so low across the kingdom that no one can be born into it. Rather, it is a restriction on citizenship imposed as a form of punishment for crimes. The criminal becomes the legal property of another, fix, uh, another for a fixed sentence. And during this period, any action that leads to a slave's death, participation in additional crimes, or even self-harm will result in the owner being charged. Okay, interesting. Um... Guys, uh, guys, by the way, if you are tuning in just now, um, I do have a VOD channel, exclamation mark VODs. You can subscribe to that, and um, everything is there from this game and Persona 3 uh, in 1440p. So you don't have to, like, watch shitty Twitch quality. That soldier is behaving most suspiciously. He keeps staring at me from across the street. He's supposed to be watching over the igniter shop. What does he have to, what does he hope to accomplish by fixing his gaze upon a fellow guard? This one? Genial Seer. Vis vestiges of Magla are left by people wandering through the city. These patterns tell me of the weather to come. Good evening, young man. I'm a fortune teller. Please come to visit me if you ever wish to know which way the wind blows. Weather, huh? Being able to predict bad weather does seem helpful, but it's not exactly high now this priority. Oh! She's a fortune teller, but she just tells weather. That's pretty cool. Uh, I guess that'd be good for, like, certain travels. I feel like that soldier across the street keeps looking at me. He's been doing it for a while. He's a guard for the church that so was probably a high, high rank. Did I do something wrong? <laughs> Dude, they're just like guarding places opposite each other, man. They can't help looking at each other. What else are they going to look at? What is this? Is that like taking in magic and powering the lights? Or is that taking in rubbish? Huh. All right. this I cannot fathom. Ah, inviting an elder into the church at a time like this. The Sanctus should know that even holy beneficence has its limits. Should I not be here? Obviously not. Your very presence here goes against our doctrine. It's oh, sacrilege. No. The scriptures tell us that the elder are a dangerous tribe. They are the inheritors of, of a treacherous magic that under undermines the tenets of sanctism. The church offers charity to the people, but the, tr but the truly devout know that the elder are not people. Leave this place at once and be quick what? about it. Hey, I'm more than happy to leave you to your hate if that's what your church teaches. Let's get where we came for and be on our way. I think the guy from the Mastadi probably has a higher chance of getting this medicine than me. I should have just given him money. Close your eye. Hmm. I see that you're an elder. I'll not turn you away if you've come here with a purpose. However, I do, he I do hope you will keep it brief. Thanks, I think. Anyway, we heard you sell a type of medicine called the Breath of Fresh Air here. Breath of Fresh Air, you say? We typically only make the particular remedy available to those who have accepted the light of sanctism. But let it be known that we practice generous generosity. By special exception for an elder, you may demonstrate your sincerity by purchasing it for 500 reeve. For an elder, 
You're raising the price because of his tribe? So are we really surprised? Surely you would not expect your vulgar tribe to stand as equals among the blessed. Our teachings forbid it. Thus, I ask you to demonstrate your sincerity. Bear in mind, to even sell, that is, give them to you is taboo. I'd appreciate a show of gratitude more than words of protest. How am I a share? God's blessing. Sancta, how am I assist? Okay. Kind of fucked up. Um, breath of fresh air. Oh, judging by the sword upon your hip, I take it you are a warrior. If you carry armaments with hidden potential, I can purify them. However, no matter since you, uh, no matter how sincere you may be, you are still, still an elder. You must demonstrate a basic understanding of sanctism if you expect my cooperation. Okay. So, all right. Uh, so certain equipment, I so I need more wisdom. Certain equipment can be taken to a church and purified, after which it is born anew with enhanced capabilities and new special effects. You can unlock the purify function by raising the wisdom royal virtue. Equipment that can be purified will be noted in the item description. Closure. Can I, can I? Uh, the phrase close ray contains lost ancient words within. Now cast your eyes downward and put your hands to your face to pay your respects and bear your soul before God. Praying while covering both eyes with both hands, I feel like not being able to see anything would make me more anxious. Hmm. Alright, what's up, Madison? How are you? Okay, so we can give the medicine to our mate. Um, I don't think there's anything else around here. Probably. I probably should really check absolutely everything. Back again? Um... Back okay. Again? Oh fuck, I just did that again. Yes. I'm doing good, just enjoying metaphor. We're playing Fortnite earlier, Shabby Elder. This won't be enough to cover the cost of tomorrow's meal. However, if only Harley were given a different fate. Oh, a new race, hold on. What now? Is that a new race? Why not take a breather? There's a nice view, and it's important to stop and smell the roses, you know. Besides, watching how the people in Grand Trad live might broaden your horizons. Oh, here we go. If I spend some time gazing the scenery, my wisdom should broaden. Oh. So what's the plan? Care for a short break? Let's okay. break. Whoa. The streets are packed, but at least it's not as huge as a crowd as the royal funeral had. Sure. Uh, uh, sure are a bunch of nobles on the main street around the Grand Cathedral. I see some Clamor, Rogue, and even some Ishkia. But if you head to the back streets, you see more Parapus. Parapus. Uh, I guess that's what the class divide looks like. And then there's you, the only elder in town. It's crazy how people will say the most vile things right to your face. I, I fucking hate it here, man. I hate it. I'm fed up with it. I know. They aren't even directed at me, and it still makes me sick to my stomach. Just remember, there's not a single thing wrong with you. So stand tall, okay? You're as free to walk these streets as anyone else. Gazing- Oh, oh, little persona! Some persona fucking notes, thank you for the hydration. Uh, I'm sorry to hear, that's all good though, Madison. You take the time you need. Gallic and I headed home while discussing the people and the stores we passed along the way. Time marches on. And the age of a new king draws nearer. Okay. Dude. Yeah, I, I freaking love this game, man. I'm going to be so honest. There's so much lore, so much to chat. Okay, let's give this guy's daughter's medicine. My dear fellow, is that the brush of breath of fresh air? Did you get that for me? Of course. Thank you so very much. Oh, praise be. I give you the deepest of thanks. With this, my daughter can be cured. I apologize for having so little faith in you. People have been quite anxious since the incident at the Grand Cathedral, so the prices on everything have increased. On top of that, the discrimination against the Mustari and other minor tribes has only worsened. Hardly any shops will serve me. Ah, but I digress. Allow me to return the favor. It's gonna give me a risky. Hardly seems worth the praise to do something so simple as purchasing medicine. If, if, if It's wrong that this problem exists within the country in the first place. What you did means the world to me. Thank you truly for saving my daughter's life. Please, you must take this token of my gratitude. Yes, sir. Pagan's Dilemma. We delivered the breath of fresh air to the Mustari man whose daughter needed it. He thanked me and gave me a reward. Rusted accessory. All right. Oh, shit. That looked like a lot. Hmm? 
An accessory? I'm sorry, but what does it do? It's so rusty, I can't tell what it is. I've heard you can get it appraised at the shop. Anywhere will do. I'm afraid I don't know more about it, as none of those places would serve me. For crying out loud, they won't even let you shop. Thank you, though. We should get this looked at. Excuse me, but I must now administer the medicine to my daughter. Thank you again, and may our divine relic bless this kind young man. No stress, no worries. All good. Hey. Knowledgeable man, if I may ask you just one thing. Are you going to the Grand Cathedral? Why? Hey, who told you that? Hmm, <laughs> calm yourself. There's no need to uh, be so wary. I won't say a word about it to anyone else. On the contrary, I'd like to help you. I've got intel on the monsters within, within the Grand Cathedral, and you could always use more information, what? couldn't you? Information. I'm what you call, I'm what some call an informant. I sell information, so how about it? Any interest in paying for knowledge? Buying intel gives you more than just what you've heard from the informant. It has various effects such as unlocking information about the enemies in battle using Analyze. Informants can be found skulking in taverns across Ukronia. Consider seeking them out, especially if you want hints about what to do next. You can view information you purchase from the item section in the menu. Okay, that's kind of cool. I kind of, I think I will. Learn about the current state of the Regolith Cathedral. Regolith Grand, Cath Grand Cathedral. According to reports, it's too... I think... So, we won't have to... Like, we'll know the weaknesses hey. and stuff, right? If you're set on going into the Grand Cathedral, be wary. I've heard that that place is a veritable den of monsters now. I must assume this is the work of that man, that necromancer. Ugh. Oh, just the thought of the bones and corpses moving on their own sends a chill down my spine. I heard they're weak to light mat... Okay, I knew that. In addition, they're scale weak to physical blows. Let your fist fly and smack them around a bit. This is Sray. Leave out the knowledgeable... He's... <laughs> He's just a... <laughs> just mad. Oh, what did, he, what did he say? Hold on. Uh, I've also... Uh, a moving stone statue. Couldn't tell you why, but there's statues in there that come to life. They're apparently immune to sword attacks, so be careful. I've seen that, actually. I've heard they're weak to wind magic, so if you're heading in there, keep light wind and weapons in your arsenal. That's all I know. I know little of your motives, but regardless, I hope you succeed. The man that is to be stopped... Uh, that man needs to be stopped. I received a scrap of paper. Okay. Hey. Okay, that's just like cool. All right. You're right. It does sound like this information could be useful. Um. I mean, we could spend some time with Hulkenberg. I apologize for making you. Yep. So. Hmm. Uh, that's like going there before the day, though, right? Like, I think that's way too early. That's probably way, way, way too early. Yeah. Um, okay, let's... So, Hello there, we meet again. Are you still interested in the Mastari? If so, then I'd be delighted to tell you more about us. I don't really want tolerance too bad right now. I'm happy being... Slightly racist. <laughs> A Rusal man dropped this mark pouch around here. Well, I'm a damn fool, so I wanted to cash it in immediately. But it ain't raining today. It ain't raining today. Oh, the worse the weather, the better the conversion rate. Oh. Okay, that's interesting. All right, all right. Astounded peasant. Ah, oh, you believe this freak? He's not moved from that corpse for ages. Even stinks. Even as the stink gets worse and worse. And never says a word, no matter what I ask him. You ask me, mind-fogged folks like him might be creepier than cad cadavers. Why are people like that? Why do people... It seems they have the, um... Uh, out of my sight? What the fuck? Someone was just, like, shouting at me from up there. Someone, uh, dude, what the fuck? They just called me... <laughs> out of my sight, filthy little elder? Dude, I was laughing so much on the weekend, my laugh just, like, tears my throat apart, man. Um, it's kind of bad because I'm talking a lot right now. You, what business do you have at the magic shop? It's closed during the day anyway. Besides, this place, this place's days might be numbered. Forget like, uh, forget Lycaon. Lycaon? Lysaon? If the Ignatic, if the Ignatic Consortium zeroes in on you, it's the gallows for sure. I know the proprietor, actually. Used to be an army doctor back in the day. I'm doing everything I can to get them to look at the look the other way. The place is too good to be busted. Oh, it's like an illegal magic shop. This place. Huh. Oh. No, it's definitely strained right now. It's definitely strained. Man in pain. 
Hey, did you hear that? Sounds like a cry of pain somewhere nearby. What you got? Oh, he's got a stummy cake. Stummy pains. Uh, uh. Hey there. Do you have any medicinal herbs? My stomach is killing me. Pretty rough shape. Sure. You saved me. Ah, it's feeling uh, it's feeling better. No worries, dude. People normally pay no mind to parapets like me, but you, you really help me. Here, take this as thanks. There is incense. Mm -hmm. That was nice of you to make that man so happy. I hope he gets better. Okay. I'm just Clemmer beggars. Seeing more and more of them these days. I heard they drifted in some village that was attacked by monsters a while ago. Yes. Halita. No. Halhala. What was it? Something like that. Is that... That's. I think that's where um, Stroll came from. Huh. <laughs> Plain child. Oh, you're an Elda. 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 Go away. Even kids are doing this. The adults are setting a terrible example. Fuck you. Fuck that fucking idiot. All right. Mug exchange. We're chilling. We're chilling. I'm good, man. I'm good. We do not have to exchange. Oi. You. You were giving me a nasty look just now. What's the idea then? I wasn't looking at all. Shut up. I thought you were eyes on me. Give me an honest answer right now or else. Oh, that sword on your hip. It's quite the beaut. You're a mercenary too. Being sent out to the Grand Cathedral or something. Not quite. Hang on there. I was just kidding when I asked. You're serious? The state of the army is desperate if you're resorting to the help of an elder. In that case, let me give you a word of advice. I know some soldiers who made it out of the Grand Cathedral alive. A great many were afflicted by it. Were afflicted with malady and poison. If you're really going in there, make sure you prepare yourself. Oh, okay, okay. So we need stuff that will protect against malady and poison. I mean, I'm not really playing on a on a on a really hard difficulty. Come to think of it. Oh, that reminds me. I think we have something that needs appraising. Why don't we take a look at the shop? What is it you want? A praise? Fuck it. A fucking appraise it. Buy? Okay, do we have? Poison. I'll get seven of them. I don't know what malady is. Is that like a, a status effect? It is, yeah? Fuck, I don't have it. Hope Jim was good. Ross, welcome back. Alright. Not bad, not bad. Let me... Hold on, let me pause the vote for a second. Let me double check something, guys. Alright, we're back. Sorry. Um. Alright, who's this? Activist woman. Excuse me. You're of the Elder Tribe, yes? Have you had any negative experiences while here? Ah, uh, no, I haven't had any problems at all. Why do you ask? Because many people in this town use tribal differences as an excuse to do the most outrageous things. I'm part of a group working to help people whose tribal origins make them a- Oh, I like you! We exist in a city. We exist in cities other than Grand Trout as well. Right now we're collecting funds for our cause. Oh fuck, you want my money though? Okay, hold on, wait. But this cause doesn't seem to interest most people, so we haven't been able to raise much money. It truly pains me to ask this of an elder like yourself. But, wait, why does it pain you? Because you feel bad for me or because you fucking hate me? Just 250 Reeve. Uh, I'm pretty fucking wealthy. I'm chill with that. I'm chill with that. Thank you. I swear I'll use your donations as best I can. I don't believe it. You really donated. Gonna be tough. Did I just get scammed? What do you think? Should we try and encourage? I don't really care about my eloquence right now. What can I, do? I don't really care about my eloquence right now. I'm going to be honest. What are you playing? Hang on a minute, you. An elder, huh? What business have you at the Grand Cathedral? And you have a fairy escort. What noble family have you absconded from? We were just passing by and we aren't anyone's servants, uh, servants or captives. Can you stop trying to pick a fight with us? Hmm. Got my eye on you. Try any funny business and I'll show you no mercy. <sighs> that man. He does as he pleases, all while concealing his true intentions. Sorry, pay no mind to what I've just said. Awful. Just awful. Huh. T yeah, it seems like the TV guy in P3R, right? Asmina Gold. <laughs> you there. 
Marsh shopkeeper. It's kind of weird that this guy can sell stuff when the other guy can't and in the same race. I mean, the other guy can't shop, though, I guess. Oh, fuck. No, no, no. Oh, shit. I just accidentally went to the Grand Cathedral. Wait, I... Oh, I forgot. Oh, before I forget, here is the uh, Ariandness thread for you. If you ever need to return. Okay. Wait, I don't want to do this right now, though. I don't have to, right? All right, then. Let's go. Okay, cool. What's at this tavern? Uh, what am I gonna do? Oh, an Aldaha. Well, I don't mind you coming in if you're just going to eat. Sorry, but could I ask you to keep your head down? The Sanctus Pilgrims won't hide the contempt for an elder if they see you. Why did they hurt the elder? Just we're in the clear, it's not me who hates your kind, it's my customers. To be honest, I couldn't care less about the tribal sensitivities. I once tried to hire a Parapus girl, but the regulars wouldn't stand for it. Something about her being filthy. Though if I could speak freely, I'd say the same about most of the clemmer. There's no, ki there's no kind way to say it. But that's simply how things are, in both this city and this country. Take care of your business and be on your way, please, for both our sakes. What am I gonna do? That's kind of troll. Can you tell me about you the city? What's all this then? Not much to tell. Really. Grand Trout is the capital of this country. Sun Lumio Street, where we are now, is where you'll find churches, igniter shops. In other words, the city's privileged are concentrated here. Straight ahead is the regular Grand Cathedral, and then nearby, the market, which gets quite lively at night. If you head down further, you'll find Sunshade Row, an unpleasant place, and where you'll find the gallows. Best to avoid that place, I think. Oh, that's literally where I, that's where I fucking, that's where I crash. And well, I think about, uh, I, I think that does about, that's about it. I suppose from a traveler's viewpoint, it's quite the city. I keep reading Grand Triad, bro. Yeah, I, I don't know why. Like, what the, what is that even from? Like, the Triad's like that gang, right? In GTA? Don't know why you'd come to ask me that. Huh. Nobody else to talk to. Ah, for goodness sake, lad. Oh, this guy's conflicted, man. That kind of, that kind of sucks, but he should speak up, you know? Um, is there anything you, is there anything to know beyond it's all become a right mess? It's all because of, it's all, um, there's drink some water. I'll fucking. Try this mafia, right? It's all that the customers chatter about now. Endless whinging about how terrified they are of humans. And I've got to stand here with their tears start, and I've got to stand here when their tears start flowing and the ale kicks in. But even after that's happened, some of them still support Luis. Boggles my mind. Terrified of the humans. Okay. The tavern keeper here is a class act. They don't use any parapist cooks in the kitchen, even though they'll work for cheap. Yes, that's good to hear. Though I must say having this elder here blight my vision is somewhat unpleasant. These people are the worst. What is it? What do you want, you louse? Isn't that lice? Lice? Louse? What do you think you're here? Uh, who, 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 who do you think you are? Staring at me like that. You want some of this too? As he points at his cock. Hmm. This fine ambrosia would be wasted on the lips of some elder child. Get... Okay, maybe he was pointing on his... What? Oh, okay, okay, wait. What? Get your own cheap drinks at the Sunshade Row. My bad, my bad, my bad. Did they literally have furries here? Oh, no, wait. Yeah, they have furries here. What the fuck? I thought they didn't fuck with furries. I'm quite sorry. You've likely heard the people in this tavern speaking ill of others on the basis of their tribe. They give their opinions too freely, especially ones, uh, once there are a few pints in them. Please take this as a token of apology. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. All right. Um, I want to hear more about this story, to be honest. I believe we're in the middle of a story. Would you care to hear the next part? Sure thing. My thanks. They hanged a furry in the first cutscene. I know, right? And then people in my chat were saying they should do that in real life. How fucked up is that, right, guys? That's fucked. Let's see. I believe we left off with my ancestor being unable to find the mysterious fairy to thank her for his savings. We've hit a bit of a time skip here, as this next part concerns my grandfather. Bear with me. My grandfather was also a mischievous sort. And one day, he too ventured into the Forbidden Cave and became hopelessly lost. Wow. Mischief really does run in the family. Ah, so it does. Anyway, lost in the dark. What should my grandfather find? A fairy, of course. She was beautiful, just as the fairy his grandfather had described. 
He knew right away that it was the same fairy. Again, I'm not going to help you this time, said the fairy, rolling her eyes. My grandfather could only blurt out a confused, What? What? It was the first time he'd ever been to the cave, after all. Then the fairy said, Don't blame me if you get eaten by the beast. And that's when my grandfather realized the fairy was mistaking him for his grandfather. The boy you're thinking about is long gone. I'm his grandson, he said. The fairy considered this for a moment and said, You people die so young. The fairy led my grandfather out of the cave, like she did his grandfather before. The whole time, he kept his grandfather's regrets in mind. So before she could vanish, he turned to her and said, Thank you for helping my grandfather. If you're wondering if, the his if history will repeat, I doubt it. My family had to leave that village when my grandfather grew up. So I'm sure you can appreciate how amusing I found it to find a fairy here in Grand Trad. My family's fate seems tied to the fairies. Dude, do you reckon we can go there, man? You people re <laughs> Do you reckon we could go there? And then we could get- we could find that fairy? Well, I'm glad your fairy got closure with the fair. I- I'm glad your family got closure with the fairy. And meeting you like this, who knows? Maybe it really is fate. All right. Imagination. Alright. Well, That's kinda cool. Cool story, bro. Full show. <laughs> Back to the harsh honey bee. Um... Oh, you got more info for me? Fancy a bit of uh, ingredients. Hey. There's a lot of ingredients available in Grand Trad. Right, if you want to cook something then. The butcher sells but dough meat, red grass. Heard something about being able to make a dish from Fabian's hometown. Why not try it out? Okay. Secret of red grass soup. Closure with the furry. There's a stall at the market in front of the Grand Cathedral that sells red grass. The herb that Fabian uses in a certain dishes. Oh, wait, that was lower. Matter of fact, red grass originates from the region where you'll also find Fabian's hometown. It's not that far from the Grand Trad, but the herb is different. It's difficult to find here. For that reason, the shop owner only sells it to her trusted regulars. Uh, any stranger? Oh, okay, okay. His trusted regulars. But you're no stranger, are you? You already know Fabian, of course, and you're also acquaint an acquaintance of Grius. Okay. Okay, I should go to the shopkeep. It's in the, um, it's in the, what's it called? The market. So. If it's in the market, it should be super active right now. I think it was like next to the Grand Cathedral. But apparently the market is bustling at night. Wait, is this it here? This looks like a market. Oh, this is the face, by the way. This is the face that's showing who's like the most popular in the race to become king. Yeah, so the bigger your head is, the more qualified you are for king. Oh, wait, why is she talking to me? Wait, what? Doesn't look like the order has changed at all since we last saw. Thou who art destined to become king, locus of his people, support great custodian of, the, of their anxieties, at the foot of this monumental stone will their feelings gather as mag. To thee, by thy daily standing accumulated, by which thy grow is empowered, this mag is henceforth- Oh, she's giving me things. I'd instantly win because my forehead is the most insane shit ever. 600 mag? Bet! Okay. Due to the king's magic, the faces of the highest ranking candidates have appeared on a gigantic stone called the Coronation Rocks. An amount of mag equal to the people's- Oh, I don't remember this, so I can go and collect- Yeah, yeah, okay. I'm not even on the rock, though. Yep. King shit. Where's the market? Whoa. Holy crap. When you accidentally go the wrong way, I guess what I get up. Oh, it's in here. Oh, here's the market. Okay, wait. Unstinking believable. Unstinking believable, she said. Where the fuck am I? I'm stuck. Very nice. Hammy shopkeep. Hmm, an elder. So long as you're a man amongst men, it matters not. Our famous mountain of meat skewers is a merely 150 reeve today. And any, any with confidence to bust their belly to scale this mass are welcome. Bust their belly? What does that mean? Hold on. Don't tell me. You're actually interested. Gallica, stand back! 
I'm about to get busted in my belly. Oh no. Now, here is a man among men. Come, eat as much as you can. I gobbled up a surprising amount of skewers one after another. Wow, look at you go. Now, he's a real man's man. I think I may just be falling for you. Okay, I think he actually did bust in me. Stomach hasn't exploded yet? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, that increased my popularity rank. My support is changing. <laughs> That's fucking sick. Parapa shopkeep. Good man. You hungry at all? I'm proud of the food we sell. Our food's sure to pick up when you're feeling off. Well, I'm still getting the hang of making all this, so truth be told, I haven't sold very much. But I figure it'll stave off your hunger at least. He did something to those skewers for sure, man. There was a, a special mayonnaise on that one. Well, isn't he an honest one? But it is true. Fighting takes a lot of energy. It's probably wise to eat a good meal beforehand. Exactly, mate. Gotta make sure you're not running on about an empty stomach. So how about it? You gonna buy something? I'll buy some blue cheese. He said he couldn't guarantee the taste, but maybe it'll improve your health a little bit. Right now you have zero. I have zero health. Is it like RNG? Do I eat it right away? Oh, I have zero cheese. I have zero cheese. Oh, that's a lie. Anxious shopkeep. People are stuck in the Grand Cathedral and here I am at work. But if I didn't show up, my mum would kill me. Ha! Huh. Your mum's the old battle- Mum! Dude, they spell mum like British people. <laughs> Where has color been spelled British? The whole cathedral business has brought in a lot of customers. I had uh, no choice but to stay open. So what do you have? Holy meat. I think I'll get some badar meat. Oh, I, I can't afford much. So I think I want to grab meat. Um, everything. Who are you? Oh my, an elder. And one with such beautiful eyes at that. Have my paintings caught your eye? If so, you've better taste than my parents. Ha, but I do apologize. All of the works here were commissioned by the nobility. So what I can what can I offer? Aside from my paintings, I sell glasswork as well. Even the sanctus buy them to decorate their churches. My glasswork protects its owner from all manners of misfortune, including illness. Just carrying it around will place you under God's protection. And best of all, I sell them at a price. Oh, okay. 5,600? Oh, I can't afford that. What the hell? Oh, did nothing strike your fancy? A shame. If you ever change your mind, do come by. That'd protect me from illness though. That's kind of cool. Kind of cool. Herb seller, so a marijuana dealer. You interested in these herbs here? Oh, Grius, don't tell me. Are you the one that's been hanging around the Honeybee Inn lately? One of his friends, truly. I come from the same town as Fabienne. So Grius and I met a long time ago. The man helped me countless times. I was quite sad to hear of his passing, though I think that deep down I always knew things that with, with him would end like this. Anyway, I couldn't possibly turn away a friend of Grius. Four for 500? Oh, we'll just grab one. Yeah. Thanks. Okay, so I needed red grass. What else was that on that ingredient list? <sighs> hmm. Okay. Grias. Grias. I'm so sad. He died. Oops. Sorry. 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 I bought from you guys. Hmm. Oh, oh, purified water, I think, was maybe something. It's quite fresh. Ha, huh, the panic at the cathedral is bringing in more people. You that. Why don't you buy some of our water? Fruit cordial. Oh, I have water. I have water. Um, okay. Um, let's do a little bit of dialogue. Oh. As of... Wait, what is this? Oh, I, okay. As of yet, thou art but a nameless rat. Oh, thank you. I'm not reading. Hold on. Fuck. I'm trolling. I'm trolling. As of yet, thou art but a nameless wretch. In the time to come, we shall judge if thou art worthy a vessel of our power. The true king who let the people, the true king who the people wouldst choose must be as culmination of the heroes of Elt. If thou shouldst use thy power as tis mean to, 
tis meant to be, the path will be open before thee. Use thy strength for justice, and save the people of the realm. Make real the world that was beyond our grasp. Did that voice belong to your archetype? It's true that under the king's rules, anyone could be crowned, even you. But I think stopping this calamity is way more important than worrying about that right now. Okay, okay. So my boy... Oh, that's like just checking your popularity ranking. All right. Um, let's go to... Um, let's go to the inn. Can I just... Was it... Sl I don't think sleep improves my wisdom. Where is Stroll and... Thingo? Oh, I should, I should, oh, sorry. I should check out the magic shop. Looking to sell, are you? Oh, sorry. Where was the, uh... Where was the magic shop? Whoa. Cautious shopkeep. I hear you with Gre I hear you with I hear you were with Grias at the shop at the honeybee. And an elder besides. Things must be interesting over there. A friend of Grias can be trusted, I suppose. But let's not discuss the legality of my goods. What have you got? Flamma butthole? What the fuck? Flamma bottle, sorry. Infused with fire magic. Oh okay, it's like uh if I wanna like hit them. Okay. Whoa, some of that shit was mad expensive. Alright. Um. I gotta stop pressing that button. Alright then. Let's go. Is anyone new at the at the inn? I do kind of have to check like a few of these places because people probably appear at different times. Let's see what, um... Oh, do you reckon... Oh! oh! Wait, are we roommates? Wait, are we roommates? Why is it that no matter how much I eat during the day, I feel oddly peckish just before sleep? Almost all the shops I used to know in the capital have been replaced now. All the unfamiliar signs. I suppose time marches on without, with or without us. Hmm. Okay, I don't think resting does anything. All right then. All right, let's um. Let's go. Did I even check the recruitment center? There's actually quite a lot to check. Wait a second. Hey now, hide your face. Oh my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. <laughs> I forgot I'm a wanted man. I'm a fucking criminal. Um, all right, let's all let's right. stop wasting time. All let's. Let's go. What's happened? Wait, I can keep talking to this guy. Ah, oh, the fairy and the elder. I'm glad we meet again. I told you the whole story about the fairy, but if you'd like to hear it again. Oh, you can just keep redoing it. Hulkenberg is a fucking dumb name. Yeah, it like doesn't suit her at all. Don't be real, literally does not suit her at all. Oh, unless I just do my wisdom again. Fuck, I feel like I shouldn't be farming wisdom right now. Fuck it, I'm a farm my wisdom. What's it? What was the first name? <laughs> what the fuck? Um. 
Wait, that was new law? Hold on. So what's the plan? Care for a short break. Let's take a break. All right, then it's decided. This is the main street. Weird that it leads to the Grand Cathedral and not the palace. It just goes to show how much the city revolves around Sanctism and the Sanctifex Forden. And Sanctifex Forden. I can't help but wonder how the king felt about all that. As well as the prince. I think it's wrong. I don't like it myself. Makes you uncomfortable, huh? I mean, I get having a healthy respect for faith, but I also don't think faith should be used as a political weapon. But it was, and now the city is in chaos. Gazing out the sides. All right. Okay, so like, it's doing the same act, but we get like a little bit more info there. We get a little bit more uh, lore. Galuk and I headed home while discussing the people and stories we pass along the way. Time marches on, and the age When did you guys go and do the, um, the bus? Oh, when did you guys go and do the dungeon? Am I like talking too much to people? Should I just go do it and then come back? Idol's day. The day where the shitty city sh shitty city shops have discounts. I didn't fucking know they had discounts at, on any day. I would have waited. All right, then. How big are the discounts? Do I talk to the, the lady? Dude, I didn't know that. Hello there. Wait, can I sell some stuff? Now then. What kind of discount are we talking here? Twenty percent. Iron lance. Golden EP. Wait, EP. He's EP. I guess Iron Lance. Indeed. Buy an item on discount. I got you. I don't think I'm gonna get armor or anything like that. I think I'm well beyond armor. I'm above that. I don't think any potions or anything. Oh, Mr. Elder Gentleman. We meet again. And I still haven't managed to collect many donations for the cause. Jesus. All right, let's talk to her. Let's talk to this this lady. Happy to hear that. Oh, you can go in more than once. Okay, I see. I might have to start going in. The Parapus and the U the Parapus, the Ugrief, and the Mustari, and of course the Elder too. These tribes are abhorred. Uh, are abhorred. Abhorred, right? Abhorred. Abhorred. I've heard abhorred, but these tribes are abhorred by the other tribes hated fucking they they hate them without a great deal of wisdom or skills it's impossible for them to get a normal job work is especially limited for them here in the royal capital you've seen the executioner in the black in the back alley right dirty work like uh like that is all uh available to these tribes wait so we become executioners uh you've seen the executioner in this back alley right dirty work like that is all that's available to these tribes having a job is better than nothing those less fortunate must choose between starvation and banditry. Actually, no. There is one other option. Become igniter experimentation subjects. Whoa. But there's no guarantee they'll survive. What's what kind of experiments? What does that entail? I don't know the specifics myself. Not many do. But you should still be careful all the same. Even though, even though igniters are now considered common and useful tools, blood is being spilled for their development. I know it. I don't have, I don't have many people on my side. And I haven't been able to help many people yet. But... Knowing there are people like you out there just gives me confidence to go on. People like you who see injustice and actually try to do something about it. This world would be a better place with more people like that. Okay. All right. Okay. It's not much, but here. Thank you for your support. I really appreciate you hearing me out. That, all right. Back to the harsh honeybee. Um, is there any more intel? No, okay. Uh, let's help her cook. Let's help Fabian. Oh, I could actually make the bado though. Wait. Let's make this. Looks like you have all the right ingredients to make the red grass roasted bado. 
Let's uh, help you get prepped and in the kitchen, shall we? Is she gonna be in the kitchen with me, though? Dude, it's me and Gallica. Gallica, you're fucking... You're, you're cock blocking me right now. Let's see here. A red grass roast, right? No problem. Fabian taught us all the ins and outs of this recipe. Oh, right. oh, how about we make a few tweaks to the dish while we're at it? Let's make it spicier. Let's stick to the recipe. Take it away, Chef Gallica. You know what, Gallica? You can decide. Why not? You take the lead, Gallica. <laughs> can I? Let's go big then. Some milk, some fruit peel for that citrus zest, some fish eyes for f fish eyes. Oh, please, Gallica. I can't put my finger on why the dish spelled. Dude, Gallica! Kind of weird. Fabienne ended up having to cook the dish herself. I'm grateful to her, but I also feel bad for giving her more work to do. All right. Oh my god, I should have just done the middle one. Gallica! Idiot! Should I, can I go back in time? Can I, like, rewind that? Is it rewind in this game? And the age of a new king draws oh, do not let Gallica cook. Do not let her cook. What now? What's happened? I, I actually don't know, but is there a re rewind feature in here? Not that I care that much, but it's fine. <laughs> Um, okay. We're gonna head in. So? True. Are there battles? That's fair, that's fair. Dude, the rewind feature in fucking Persona 3 goated. Now, where was I? Um, no, that's not good. I could do that. We're chilling. Onward. Oh, let's Got do it. it. What do you think? Let us hurry. Let's do it. Still signs of Margaret throughout, but at least his attempts at least her attempts at ambush us have failed. Alsis. Hey. We don't have time for feeling sorry. We've got to take the opportunity to do what I, what we can. To make sure that Grius's death yes. wasn't in vain. I know. We're Let's up. proceed. Um my calendar? What's it looking like? What now? Have a week? Should be good, right? Alright. Let's do some fighting. Can I ride my... Oh, no. Dude, I don't think the costumes have been working, by the way. I, I like, applied the costumes before. And nothing happens. But there was an update today. Oh, they patched it. They actually patched it today. Um... They patched it. I see. Yeah, there was there was a bug where uh, nothing, none of these would apply. Wait, I could look exactly like uh, uh, I could look exactly like Persona Five right now. Hold on, is this the dude? This is literally like kind of the Persona Five squad because you got the girl. Wait, actually, yeah, you got the girl with red hair. I can't remember her name. Oh, but Joker doesn't have blue hair. Fuck, not quite. What now? Looks cool though. Let's try them all on. As Persona 3. Kinda cool, kinda badass. What now? Uh Seven Sisters? High school? Persona 2? I know nothing about Persona 2 to be honest. Is it Persona 2? Kind of a cool uniform. What now? Do I have a better weapon by the way? Bronze machete? Or are these, um, are these... Whoa, what the fuck? Are these, uh, Shin, Meg Shin Megami Tensei? What now? Alright, we're just gonna go back to the OGs, though. I do get the other soundtracks when you wear those. Alright, let's see. What? Parapa's woman. Oh, oh. Sheesh. What's going on here? Oh wait, she Did actually. Someone get here before us. Voice acting. Let's go. All the places. Do you not know it was safe to come this way? Hello. This really isn't the time to pay your respects. No easy way to say it, but this place. I don't know. It ain't right. There's dead folk shambling about. Mass after a clean house. 
Don't say I didn't warn you, eh? I'm off then. Wait. <sighs> Is it your intention to enter the Grand Cathedral? How do you know it connects down here? Because we're the ones who cleared the path. But I assume we'll meet more resistance inside. I beg your pardon, but are you not injured? Shouldn't you consider turning back? Oh, I'm sorry, boss. Did I need your permission? I've got my own reasons. At least stop and treat your wounds. At the very least, wounds. you need to stop and get those wounds treated. I can't do that. My friend's trapped in there. And the soldier that went in to rescue her hasn't come back. I can't just sit and do nothing. We will rescue her. We will rescue her. Hey, wait. Before you go making promises... Ah, uh, Gallica, relax. Bad. We got this. Now that we know about this, we must act to save these people. What's your you know her? Exactly? We simply won't stand by and let someone in your condition walk into peril. I don't believe you. You're hiding something. Some other reason you're willing to help a parapus. Believe no. what you like. But we're going to the top of the cathedral regardless. Is it not the wiser course to let us do as we've promised than to risk your life charging ahead? Fine. Even I can see sense in Her that. Japanese VA is, is Jolene, Paris. you think? Oh, that would be that so cool. Age, with a yellow flower pin in her black hair. You'll know her when you see her. If you bring her back safe, I'll repay you. I swear. Okay, blood. Alright, a friend in need. Parapus woman needs me to find her friend who was left behind in Rigolith Grand Cathedral. 5k reward. Alright, bet. Alright, let's go do that. Oh, come on. Okay, we're gonna absolutely fly through combat. It's not even funny. It's literally just not even funny how fast we're gonna do all this. I'm about to fucking lose. Alright. Well, is that really loud? Is the combat super loud? Probably was, right? My bad, my bad. All right. Getting in was easier than I thought it'd be. It doesn't look like there's anyone patrolling the air. How strange. I expected less resistance this way, but not this little. Oh, well. In any case, it works better for us. Capturing that necromancer isn't going to be our only goal anymore. We need to save the hostages while we're here. Let me just balance this. Alright, that's probably good. Here we go. Ooh, let's go. All right. What are we doing? Some light damage. Oh, shit. Um, maybe wind. What are you weak to? All right. I guess I might team up. Actually, no. She doesn't have any good team up moves. I'm gonna draw attack. Oh, okay. It didn't. Did it not have any attack? You can do this. Lend me your strength. Dude, it's actually kind of tanky. Uh -oh. Brace yourself. Oh, it just disappeared. Whoa. We have the edge. Wait, there's lots of them. What the fuck? Mad watchdog. Healer, the power of light. Right. They didn't give me any description on what these guys would be weak to. Oh, weak wind damage to all enemies? Nice. Looks like that's all of them. Da -da -da. Job, bad. Katharina. Okay, okay. New skill. Weak HP recovery for all allies. I imagine that would be of use. Ah, uh, yes. You'd be right, I think, maybe. Wait, where, where, where? <laughs> Did I see a chest on the map, but... Is it back there? Huh. Huh, huh. What's going on here? Where did I just go? This place. It's as I thought. The Magla here is thinner. Perfect place to rest. Oh, okay. If so. Magla Hollow. <sighs> okay. Transport. Uh oh, Gallica can transport you from one Magla Hollow to another. You can even go back and forth between dungeon and entrance. 
If your party's uh, feeling spent, sometimes it's necessary to stop and return to town to refresh yourself. Take advantage. Then okay. So it's like, um... Make a record is safe. Ah, uh, okay. This is, this is a safe room. But it's basically uh, an elevator. Um, well, why is, she, why is she over the table like that? Okay. This is a great relief to discover a safe point here. I believe it will take some time to reach our quarry. But still, we mustn't take too long. I don't know what... Uh, de yep. Don't even stress. No. Don't even stress, gang. We got this. On gang. Uh, res resume exploring. How do I get that chest down there? Right there. Is he gonna attack? I'm trolling. But it is, we're back on our weep shit. I need to level up so I can just insecure these things. Alright. Well. Maybe it's, I, I actually have no idea what Fire Emblem's like. I only know the characters in Smash Bros. You're late. You were supposed to be here ages ago. The thing is, what was I supposed to do about it? We can't use the lift. I had to take those bloody endless stairs to get here. Just keep an eye on that uh, lot locked up in the spare room, on the desk. Okay. White clouds will probably know it. <laughs> They're no friends of ours. Must be nice to be so superior because you get a white cape. I assume that's Luis's private army. They lack discipline, though. I imagine this guard was hastily thrown hey. together. They had colored uniforms, but they mentioned white ones. What's that about? The rank of a soldier in Luis's private army is signified by the color of their uniform. Those with uniforms bearing colors are common soldiers. His elites have pure white uniforms and are thusly called the white clads. Ah. All right, so the guard's leaving. Um, wouldn't this be a good opportunity to help the hostages? Yeah, and the, yeah the, the, there's so many Smash Bros. characters from freaking... Um, fire of them. Good point. I'm not seeing any guards around. And they all do the same thing as well. All right. All right. So let's go up the hostages. They said that there was a, a spare key somewhere in the office. Oh, okay. Oi! Let us go, please. We have families. At least let the injured go at this rate. We're here to help. We need a key to open the room. Look for it right away. Just hold on. All right, bet. We're going to hold novel out loud. It's fine. My voice, like, really struggles. Jesus Christ, that motherfucker got impaled. Um, reading doesn't really fuck my voice up. It's mainly, like, um, snoozing soldier. You better not wake him up. Oh, no, my hand. What have you done? Huh? What? What was that? I just fucking intentionally woke him up. Oh, he had dogs with him. Oh. Let's do this. My power Almost finished. Let's take care. Fuck, I don't know. We don't have enough turn meter for this. Shit. Mm. Everyone's attack rows? Okay, that's really bad. Holy shit, wait. Oh, they're, they're, oh they're, the rest are dead. That's true. See ya. Oh, holy light. Do I not have like a regular attack? Fuck. Alright. Alright, we leveled. Alright, leveling is good because then um, it Oh, did I just forget something? I don't know if I, I forgot a move. I don't think I did. I have like barely any moves. Let me double check. What now? This should be okay. Nice. Okay. Let's go. Here we got the key for the guys up top. I, I think this is where the chest is. is. Nice. Oh, that's lovely. Gambler's jewel. A jewel that slightly augments luck. luck. Yeah. Onward. Whoa, there's a bunch of people. Thank you so much. I was sure my number was up there. No, we're too late for some. If we could only have done something. Still, tis good that some yet live. Are there any other hostages here? I don't know, but I was hearing screams from all around it when it first began. This is awful. None of those people were even armed. 
Right now, we need to focus on the survivors. Make ready to leave, and we'll escort you to the exit. Now then. The others have all escaped to safety. You're the last of them. Thank you for everything. We're in your debt. Hey. Oh, would you know anything about the Parapus girls here? Parapus girl here? She'd have black hair, and we know she wears a yellow flower hair clip. A Parapus girl. That sounds familiar. But I think I saw her among the casualties. What? Wait, does that mean? It. Fuck, she died? If you knew her, please see that she's returned to her family for a proper burial. She was rallying behind the wounded until the last. Of course, we'll do what we can. Strel and I will see this man safely away. As we do, will you not tend to the poor Parapus girl? It is a burden I am loath to place on you alone, but... Shit, she died. Her friend died. Look at her ears. She's a Parapus. Hey, wait. Sorry I'm late. She cradled her friend in her arms, whispering the words, I'm sorry to her over and over. Thanks. Guess I ought to come clean. I tried, I really did. But I couldn't just stand around. And you lot cleared the path so well besides. So this is all I have right now, but... Friend in need. We found the Parapus woman's friend, albeit too late to help her. Despite the outcome, she was grateful for our help. Give me a little time, would ya? I've got a bounty I'm after that'll be paying big. Yo, Snow, thank you for the raid, man. Yo, welcome raiders. Hello, hello. Hope you had a good time in uh, in Snowstream, guys. All right. Guys, give Snow a follow if you haven't already, though. Super funny guy. Give me a little time, would ya? I've got a bounty I'm after that's paying big. Let's have a look. Collect bounties. What? You joking? You only help me because you recognize me, yeah? I've got no idea who you are, lady. You really don't know. I'm Katharina, the bounty hunter. And you just helped a parapus without expecting anything in return. <laughs> Doesn't that just take the cake? I'm a good guy. Dude, everyone in this world is super racist. Well, you were in trouble. Uh, I mean, weren't you in trouble? Proper weird you are. I'll tell you though, I gave her that hair clip gift to say congrats for getting hired and for some rich baron things went belly up and she got that <laughs> baron safety, but didn't make it out of Dom, I hope you do well. when he heard the news do you know what he did he laughed said even a parapus could be useful once in a while crazy that's deranged some people are terrible isn't it oh, i thought so too a world like that i'd tear it down with my own two hands if i could people are suffering and all these bastards can do is shrug and carry on. I feel the same. I couldn't have said it better. Right. I can see as much in your eyes. Matter of fact, I see a lot in your eyes. You're cutting a path, and it's no small prize you're after. And now we kissed. I don't know if we'll cross paths like this again, but if you're ever in trouble, I'll be there. That's a promise. Thank you. Thank you, kind British lady. I can sense Katharina's righteous spirit and faith in me. The loyal hunter. Oh, here we go. Katharina. Within her dwells the virtue of Oh the shit, border. she actually becomes Let a teammate. I bond with her, and a new power yet slumbering within thee may awaken. I mean, she's too like unique looking to not be a teammate, right? Deal. Dude, taunt deal. Here we go, then. Brawler archetype. The party can now study the brawler. I unlocked Megatron? I can sense the heroic embodiment of the brawler from Katharina. You can now study the brawler in academia. Dude, oh my god. She's actually kind of jolly. Not gonna lie, man. She's... Dude. My harm is here. <laughs> now, I'm gonna take this poor girl home. Catch you later. If we can Dude, and she like actually has she has Jolene's voice actress in Japanese. I might have to switch to Japanese, man. Got it. All right. Pushing. Oh, incredible. No way, pink fur. No, I'm. A, she's allowed. She's allowed. Oh, for the brawler. Okay. 
Oh, uh, here you go. It looks like a mirage of the cat from academia. What is it you're doing here? Well, Moa did mention that the cat would help us in our journey. I think he wants you to pet him. By petting Mirage, by petting the Mirage of Moore's cat, pet cat, you can save your progress in dungeons, like you would in a Magla Hollow. You can also prepare yourself in Academia or return to the dungeon's entrance. If you spot him, try petting him. I just want to pet him, man. I just want to pet him. I don't want to. I don't want to say. Uh, I mean, I'll say, but yeah, I'll switch the. I'll switch the language. He seems so like uh, it seems like he's saying he'll record our journey up to here. Probably has something to do with that weird igniter hanging from around his neck. It's strange, but I feel like I can calmly think back on everything that's happened when I touch this cat. I guess there's not much time for reflection. When we're in battle after all. We should pet him again and see what we're Okay. It's a Grace. Yeah, yeah, the Grace is a cat. Wait, the Grace is a cat in this game. That's kinda That's kinda like the best. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Right there. Oh, should we get the whole group here? Oh, you're fucked. I, I can't hit both of them here. Oh, he's stunned though. Oh my god, resist. I'm trolling. Dude, this game might actually be Dark Souls. Oh, the are physical. Okay, I don't think there's any more backup coming. Let's keep moving. This game is still so joke. Okay. Oh. Where's my squad? I feel like I'm so much faster than them. What is this? This looks like the the phantom the the puppet gun in boss room. Being able to run through weak enemies is so good, man. This is the lift, right? I've never seen one this big before. Maybe I should have expected as much, seeing as this is the Grand Cathedral in the Royal Capital. But... I doubt it's working at the moment. They can't be that foolish. Oh, but they are. Which means we've got to take the stairs. Sure, it'd be nice if we could use a lift, though. Okay, more, uh, more elevators. Now then. Well, you ready to tackle this? I see no other path open to us. They love, uh... Hey stories how far have we climbed it feels like this goes on forever dude not that far like literally uh, keep moving why do they have to make it so th tall in the first place it's way too big whose idea was this wait are we just going around in circles though they probably wanted to show that the kingdom already belonged to sanctism sometimes a good bluff is all it takes from what i can tell the state army's authority is all in name only no credible substance to it as a knight that pains me to hear, but frankly, I feel the same. The powers that do uh, that be do not extend the hand of the weak. Which is likely why you see men like Luis doing as they please. It's the bloody end of the world. Luis will have to wait until uh, after we've gotten to the necromancer. We'll deal with him first. That will be. That we will say, what the fuck? But I could swear I'd seen the man before. What was that? You're muttering. It says nothing. Let's hurry and get to the top. We haven't time to dawdle. Right, so she's apparently seen the necromancer before. Interesting. Uh, we finally made it. I never want to see another step in my life. Seems like the stairs do not reach the apex. How do we proceed from here? Surely there's a passage leading upward somewhere. If we would keep going up, it's bound to be a working lift. Alright. Hey. Strange noise. Mm -hmm. Something's amiss. What was that? Boy! Stop! Oh, okay, the, the corpses. Alright, corpses are good because we can one hit stuff. I think, I, I'm gonna assume. Or at least we get weak procs. It's probably a Magla room. That Magla hollow. Here. Mm -hmm. Find place to rest. All right. All right. Let's continue. Locked. Oh, 
Oh, was that what resting was like in Persona 5? I can't remember. I really didn't play much of that. I need to get back to it. Looks like they're being manipulated by magic, like Alsu's was. I suppose this is what the soldiers were afraid of. But the necromancer controls them, doesn't he? Why would he endanger his own forces? Probably because dead bodies are more used to him, I'd say. Or more used to him. Damn, okay. You gotta be kidding me. Is he insane? It would explain why there were so few guards in patrol. He was planning to leave this area to the, to the dead to begin with. And that's why he massacred so many. Damn him. How can he treat people's lives like his playthings? Or um, safe rooms. Okay. Uh, what am I doing? Whoa. I tried dodging that. Oh my god, there's a whole team. I tried dodging that, but... I don't think I could cancel my attack. Oh, shit. All right, here we go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. This isn't good. It's all right. We're all weak to this. We're chilling. Yeah, no, I, I don't know if it was because I was on the stairs, but I, I was anticipating the attack. New skill, sweeping slash. All right, we're going to heal. It's all right. Oh, human. Went to the gym? Oh, shit, okay. You, are you with the sad army? You finally come. I'm sorry. If we'd only come sooner. Don't let it plague you. Such is fate. The soldiers who attacked us have faced his divine punishment. I never expected I'd meet my end at the hands of the dead. Ha, huh, what a miserable lot they are. The soldier who stabbed me, I believe is passed away around here. He is forsaken by God for believing in the likes of Luis. Did you wear a watch ring? They gave, they gave you silver instead? What, um, what watch does it go with? What phone does it go with? Wait, like a, like a, like a, like a Samsung ring thing? Wait, what the fuck is this? Silver instead of gold? Maybe, if you show it to me. Chicken! Yay! Human! Two dollar ring from Timu? Ah, uh, yeah, show me. Show me what it looks like, fuck it. Um... Did you send your stuff to Alex, by the way? Look at the time like that. Yeah, I put watch ring. That'd be kind of badass, but I, I've seen that. And it's like, how would you like lift weights like that? I'm counting on you. Observe the to you. No. Let's do this. Healer. Oh, holy light. Stunned, you fucking did it, you clown. Hold on. Only one. Oh, we're gonna. I call upon the royal power within. To the four. To the four. Uh, do I want to pass? Yeah, I could you probably first. pass and attack with main boy. Wait, this thing's fucking got a lot of health. Hold on, I'm trolling. I'm griefing. I'm griefing. This thing has so much health. Oh. Oh dear. Miss? Are you prepared? 100 damage? <laughs> Shit. By this power. Is everyone all right? With blade in hand. Just... She doesn't have much health. I don't think I can kill it like this. Unless I can stun it? Fuck. No, no, no. Da -da -da -da. I need to restore um percent. Let me have a look. Also, um, did you did you message Alex? Magla pill, 20 MP. Probably to heal I yeah. Helpful as ever. Now Oh, holy light. I'm back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Shit, it was fire. Did he, uh, that's so funny. It's literally a watch ring. That's so fucking funny. That's actually the funniest shit ever. It's actually a watch ring. I'd wear that as a joke. It works too. Bro, I, feel, I mean, uh, next time I see you, just bring it. That's so funny. You guys the one you want. It's actually pretty fucking funny. That's some real shit. Did he ask you to caption it? I fucking didn't send him a caption. I didn't know I had to. Whoops. 
Motherfuckers have a pocket one? They're gonna get you. Guys, should I sing Ni Wah Wah? Word for word? Oh my god, I don't have anything for this, man. That's just terrible. I can't believe they kill allied soldiers. Look. Look, there's something up ahead. Isn't that a Magla crystal? It looks different from the ones we've seen before. It looks like some kind of demonic flower. Blast enemies. Look at that. That petal like energy might be Magla that's leaked from the crystal. I think that's what's drawing the monsters in this area. It has a fitting look if the fiends are drawn to its scent. We'd better break it before moving on. Trans crystals have the power to attract enemies. Approaching a trans crystal will cause it to summon new enemies until it is broken. If you stumble upon one of these, try to prioritize destroying it. Fuck, it's only stroll though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa! Ooh! Oh, they're. What the fuck is that? Oh, they're just regular enemies. I'm too strong for them. Holy moly. Shit. Love hearing me read this. Do you actually, Jimma? No way. Jimma, how are you, man? Hello, hello. Fuck. See ya. Good. Racist 3D man with red hair? I have a 3D woman on my team with red hair. Is it racist to not know which Asian country someone is from by looking at them? I don't think that. It's just as long as you don't like... I guess assume. Or like outwardly be like, yo. I mean, who knows though? Like someone could tell me you look Mexican. Maybe. No what what other like, like Asian do you think you'd look like? Like um Maybe Vietnamese or Korean? Really Korean. Am I XPing off these guys? I actually am. We're getting so much XP in this round now. I can't, I can't target the flower! Oh, fuck. <laughs> How do I get this key? Oh, traumatized soldier. Why has this happened? We looked up to Lord Luis. We finally joined his army. So why has this happened? He's acting strangely. He sees us, but he's just sitting there. Huh, what do you want? Not like it matters. I'm not obligated to catch intruders anymore. Why are you, where are your comrades? I'm sure you saw it. The dead suddenly started attacking. Then my comrades all died in the blink of an eye. We're just lowly soldiers, disposable pawns to them all along. Nothing matters. No one's going to help. On this floor, you, wait, what happened uh, to the hostages? None on this floor survived. I'm sure you've seen the carcasses, the carnage, haven't you? We captured them first, but they ultimately ended up being our downfall. Huh, isn't that ironic? Nothing matters. No one is going to help. We want to go up. There's a doorway along the hallway. A doorway? There's a door along the hallway. Exit through the storage room and you'll be able to make your way upstairs. PewDiePie? Really? What did PewDiePie say? No, I don't think he is, man. I, dude. Loki, I don't think KSI is pretending anymore. We can, uh... I'm getting better at reading, right? If we exit the storage room, if we fuck, fuck me, fuck! If we exit the storage room ahead, we should be able to go up, apparently. You don't think he was making it up, do you? I find it hard to believe he would, given the circumstances. Besides, we have no choice but to take his word. Um. I actually think he was, um. This is actually a good point to save. I was supposed to play Apex with Dane as well. Um. Let me, let me pause here for a second. Let me pause the recording. 
I don't have much uh, much time to play right now, but uh, I think I did just save right now. I don't know if I'm going to combine this into another VOD or... Um... Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the VOD channel. Uh, this, I'm not too sure if it's, if it's going to be episode 4, 5, or 6. I have no idea if I'm merging these two VODs from today and yesterday. Uh, but we're, we're halfway through the Grand Cathedral. Probably a little bit more than halfway through. Um, if you missed what happened in the last stream... Um, Honestly, not, not a lot happened, but we're on our way to the top of the, um... So let me double check the audio is not too loud. We're on the way to the top of, um... The Grand Cathedral, where the necromancer that's working with Luis is located. I haven't gone back in a while either, so I have absolutely no mana. Um... So that's sick. I don't know if I'm gonna have to return home. Are you prepared? Oh, holy light! Oh, they're great at Pokemon. We were talking about Pokemon earlier before on stream. It's newer, yeah. So the turn base in this game, um, it works differently. In t like, there's a few different rules. So let's just say, I think if you get staggered or if you miss, you lose two turn meters. So our turn meter is, are those little crystals at the very top. So we have two turns left. I can yield and pass my turn, and then I only lose half a turn meter. Um, so, like, you can pass the turns off to your teammates. Um, you can team up with teammates and do, like, duo attacks. Um, I'm gonna have to draw their attention. And then once you're too sh once you're, like, strong enough in an area, you can, um... Oh, let's fucking go. When you're strong enough in an area, you can literally just, um... Kill enemies in the overworld and not enter turn-based combat. It's actually pretty cool. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we have positioning as well. Lineup attack, so... Yeah, so if you're in the front... If you're in the front of battle, you do more damage, but you also take more damage. I don't know what positioning is like in... Yakuza, but... Yeah, there we go. So, I am... I probably am going to pass my turn here. I want, um... Yeah, we're going to pass that turn. We're going to pass two of our turns. Here we go. I think so. I think Pokemon is for sure, like, kind of increased my tolerance for turn-based games. Sometimes I do just fly through these areas, though, which can be pretty annoying. Like, I'll just flick through menus like a madman. I, I love the combat in this game. All right. And the way this game is similar to Persona, I have no mana right now, so I haven't been able to do it. Um, oh, I did it actually once, but this whole game kind of revolves around the idea that you're the main protagonist. Dude, did you guys hear Typhlosion lore? New Typhlosion dropped? New Ty Typhlosion lore just dropped? Um, yeah, what's up, Daha? Hello, hello. Hope you're doing good. Um, I think it's a fan thing. Apparently, Typhlosion fucked... I actually, I'm not even going to go into it. Um, the Day of Calamity, I, I don't know what actually happens, but I think uh, very bad things happen. But it's currently the 16th, and the Day of Calamity is on the 21st. So we've got a lot of time. we got time. we got time. I'm doing good, Rose. Gaha, splendid work, crossing the Sea of the Dead. I haven't a clue who you are, but you seem to be quite skilled. That voice does not belong to the necromancer. Show yourself, who are you? I am but a soldier who swears fealty to Lord Luis, and you must be one of the elite knights of the state army, or something of the sort. Come to the top of this tower if you're able. I find myself quite at my leisure up here. I'll be glad to help you. I'll be glad to keep you company. We've been told to take care of any unsightly rats scurrying around. Hehehe. <laughs> The voice is gone. Where's Fabian? It's kind of fucked up because, yeah, I, I really did like, um, Grius. Grius was so cool. He died and he left behind a widow. And I'm trying to riz her up now. He knows about the chaos happening on the lower floors, but doesn't seem to be bothered. He's skilled. Must be an elite soldier under Luis's direct command. You mean he's one of those white clads we heard yes. about? Tis likely. In any case, let us proceed with caution. However, I might, I might actually have to go back and find uh, Fabian. Uh, but yeah, it was good. Earlier on stream, we were just looking at old clips. I was actually watching old YouTube videos as well of mine. Ooh. We've been spotted. We're going to go back to... Uh, the starting area. What? He seems to be holding some sort of string in his mouth. Let's use it. In that case. Let's call it. Ugh. 
Oh, that's not that bad. Um, I think we'll have a little bit of, uh, like, re-navigating to do. Understood. All right. Rest is important, so let's grab something to eat. Cool. All right, so I think after after doing the dungeon during the day, you can't actually do anything at nighttime. Ah, uh, hell. The honeybees all full up. Just my luck. Oh. No seats left, but I'm starving. If so. Is that how they, they explain us not being able to do anything? To it seem we'd need to have our dinner elsewhere. Let's go to the tavern over yonder. Your thoughts? Now for Lono. A large establishment and the owners and patrons alike are busy with their own matters. We may speak freely there without fear of eavesdropping. I see. Then it's settled. Anyway, if we discussed Luis at the honeybee, we would we could end up causing more trouble for Fabienne, so this works out. No Fabienne today. Resting at night after a day of battling, you and your party will need to rest your weary bodies the night you return from a dungeon. Enjoy a hearty meal together and take it easy before the day comes. Ah, I'm absolutely pooped. Good job getting up all those stairs today, everyone. The whole ordeal has really made it clear what kind of people serve Luis. They'll stop at nothing to achieve their goals, no matter how awful. Their victories validate their idea of justice. They seem generally unconcerned by the state army's attempt to get in. Then... Well then, let's let's knock uh, let's knock them off their high horse. Let's give it to them, and not uh, let up until we're through. Hold on. What should we talk about? <laughs> You can't be that awkward, bro. What should we talk about? What's up, Tay? Hello? The status of our requests. I wonder if Katharina is still mourning her friend. If only we had gone to her faster that day, then maybe, just maybe. Their fate was sealed at the moment of her attack. Even if we had been slightly, significantly faster, the outcome would have remained. It is likely that she had already come to the same conclusion. Hence, why she thanked us, despite the outcome. For, some, for someone to receive such cruel, uh, such a cruel fate, Simply because of their tribe and social standing, this world truly is broken. Uh, hold on. What should we talk about? Got a sec? Just six days until the calamity. We've got no time to lose, considering how little we know about the guy. What? Exactly. And if we can't rely on the state army to handle it, then we'll just have to stop him ourselves. Well, well suppose we ought to turn in for the night once we finish our plates. Uh, I'd say we earned our rest today. Good job. Bad, bad, bad. After a short break, everyone recovered their HP and MP. I returned to the bedroom and settled into a peaceful slumber. Yeah, kind of go to the read. You know, we're getting there. I'm kind of, you know. On, and the age of a new king draws nearer. All right, bad, 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 bad. It's all good. Water's day. All right. What you been up to today, Tay? Okay, so now we have the option to go fight again, or we have the option to uh, to talk to NPCs here. Yeah. Dude, it's Persona, but like AOT. Tay, that's kind of how, I, how I've been explaining it. Uh, we could learn more, more about this guy's tribe. Um, we could talk to the lady that's trying to, like, not be racist. Oh, no, I should buy more of this stuff. Where? Alright. Have a large variety of goods. Do you have anything that will give me more MP? No MP, man. I mean, Wednesday, my were you like thinking of quitting like a few days ago, or like a week ago? You were like, "Fuck, just about to throw in the towel." Um, I need to get my brains up. I mean, let's let's talk to the activist woman. All right, Mister Elder Gentleman, we meet again. I still haven't managed to collect my donate many donations for the course. Okay, there's no way you. Okay, she actually is the guy that cons you in fucking Persona Three. She actually is. Let's head there right away. We back, we back. Dude, I'm so behind everyone. I'm, I'm fucking slow. Oops, right. sorry, sorry. I forgot how to sprint. Oh, I just TP'd. Catacombs entrance. Unless we just go fight again today. All right, we could just fight again, honestly. Oh, let's met. Tough. Hmm. Let's head there right away. I, I think it's gonna retell the story where you still am. Only the poverty might catch up to. Okay, that doesn't sound worth. Um. No, we don't want to hear it again. I 
see. All right. <coughs> Dude, I kind of want to get my intellect up. Excuse me. I kind of want to get my intellect up because then we can um, we can riz this lady up, I believe. Um, yeah, at least describe the job. So she wants to give me a job. I might honestly do that. At, at first, there's a stat called tolerance, which is basically how racist you are. I wanted to boost that and reduce my racism. But now that the baddie wants me to get intellectual, I kind of have to do that. Um, so we're going to take in the environment. Yeah, I'll show you. Hold on, look. Being in Grand Trad makes me tired. There's barely any greenery. It's all just buildings and igniters and whatnot. It's stifling. At least some people planted trees, huh? I guess that counts for something. When we're done with this place, I just want to go somewhere quiet. I agree. Yeah, it's not exactly a place uh, to have a nice time, is it? Huh, I knew you'd agree with me. When this is all over, I just want to take it easy in the countryside. I'm going to sprawl out on a tree limb and just look up to the stars. Gazing out uh, has made me feel more wisdomish. I'm your favorite. Okay, team racism is insane. Oh, I'm informed. I can talk to her now. Okay, so yeah, these are all the stats. You have courage, wisdom, tolerance, which is basically racism because like the more you learn about other cultures, the, the more tolerant you become. Uh, eloquence and then imagination. Uh, Tis one of the virtues a ruler must possess. If thou aspire to true, if thou aspire to true sovereignty, fill thyself with knowledge to discern truth from falsehood. A conqueror needs that precious kindling with which a follower's passion may be inflamed. And it makes a crown. Gallagher and I headed home. Yeah, As Asmund Gold needs to do all those side quests for real. Back to the hushed honeybee. Um, okay, so we can... Let's see if Grius's daughter wants to come out. Okay, we're just going to leave her be. Um, we... We might talk to... Fabian. Yeah. Uh, but she's just kind of like if we want to make food and she's more tolerant. I'm too busy, so. Um, I'm going to see if... Let's go. Is this lady outside her shop at night time? Oh, she is. Okay, so we should be able to actually take her request now. What is it? Come to ask me about the job. This lady owns the igniter shop, right? I bet the pay would be decent. Might be worth taking the job if nothing too crazy. If I put my overflowing wisdom on display, I'll be able to stand my ground with people as powerful as this woman. Yes. Well, well. I suppose you really are more than you seem. I certainly can't imagine Grius would have worked with any normal child. Glad to hear it. Now I'd like to see what you're made of. Allow me to reintroduce myself. My name is Brigitta. Brigitta! I run this shop and manage trade of magic igniters. This is your first time in Grand Trad, you mentioned. Then, what do you think of magic igniters? They're unnecessary. They make things easier. I don't know if I have to like people please in this game that much. I'm going to say they make things easier because she sells them. I suppose they make some things easier. Aha! Uh -huh. Situationally easier, but not broadly useful, eh? We have a good grasp of it then. All right, next. Are you good at keeping secrets? That's a secret. Oh, that's fucking funny, dude. I think I am. That's a secret. I'm afraid that's a secret. You're so lame. You're trying to be funny. <laughs> on nerve. I have one last question. Do you believe in God? Oh, shit. Everyone's faith is their own. Not the one everyone else does. I have my own beliefs. Hmm. In other words, not the God of Sanctity. I wonder if she appreciates well, that. That's enough for me. Hmm. Okay. Wait, she's interesting. Yes. I think there's potential in you. I'd like to ask you to handle an extermination mission. What? Like an assassination? The, task. the fact is, our trade route for Ignitus has been, shall we say, compromised. 
A local monster's apparently made the place its feeding grounds. Evidence suggests its actual nest is near the place I personally checked out. I want you to go there, find it, and exterminate it. Wait, hold on just a moment. You're asking us to handle something so important? Is that even okay? I'm asking you precisely because it's so important. There are reasons I'd rather not bring this to the guard. I usually prefer discretion with these sorts of things anyway. Especially with groups like them. But if Grius trusts you, then I certainly can. Thank you. How are you connected with Grius? I hardly think that bears discussion right now. Oh, okay. What do you think? It does seem like she could use the help, but you will be compensated. Alright, we should dap her up. And generously. There's also the option of discounts on my stock, if that appeals. Additionally, rumor has it there's even treasure to be found at the monster nest. I'd say the potential rewards are a fair match for the risk. She's got like less harsh features, right? Someone connected to Grius probably wouldn't try to trick us. It doesn't seem like a bad deal between the compensation and treasure. How are you I doing, Ajax? No objections to the job. I do. Dab me up. Dab me up. Understood. Thank you. You're bound for Belega Corridor. It's only a short distance away from here. Oh, she's not a connection. I thought she would have been. I need to slay Goop. I need to slay Goop Toros in Belega Corridor. Corridor. The informant in Grand Trad, who's usually at the Hushed Honeybee Inn on Sunshade Road, should have more details. Okay, that'll. Here. Just think of the goodies that might be hiding inside. That'll probably take me a few days to travel to. Okay, I don't think I'm I'm traveling there. If you don't have a way there, I'll lend you my oh. carriage. Not the kind of trip you'll want to make on foot. You True. can leave the city through the large gate south of the central street. Don't die out there now. Am I doing that right now? Oh, sorry, I was really close to you. Um Don't forget our mission. True. To get there, you can exit from the large south gate or speak with me. Oh, I can do it with Evs? Oh, fuck. I might do it right now, then. Um. I might do it right now. Uh, let's go to the inn. Unless I can't do it at night. Ox Demon of Beleaga Corridor. Who told you about the Beleaga Corridor? That place may still harbor some treasure, since not many know about it. However, word has it that there is a grotesque Guptoros, a gigantic two-legged beast brandishing an axe. It's quite famous amongst adventurers. It hates anyone who uses a staff or mace, and it will go berserk if it sees one. Watch out if you start to build up strength. The next hit, whoa. That said, if you time, if you time your attacks well, you can knock it out of his sands and halt its attack. I recommend a swift pierce attack with a spear. It's weak to them. Mage and healer, yeah. Okay. Oh, they're stronger. Str okay, okay. Alright, that's actually good intel. I would have gone in without that. Right. True, actually, all the rogues do have white hair. She just has softer features, right? I feel the rogues have kind of aggressive features. Um, I could, I mean, I could do that right now, surely. How much harder can they be? Okay. Oh, but they're going to be low level archetypes. I've been waiting. Let me see. I mean, knight should be fine. I could give, um, Stroll Brawler. Or even Warrior again. Warrior's got a bit of level. Physical Slash. Expends life force. Oh, so less, um... Yeah, we just, we just go back to warrior, I think. Skill inheritance. No, we're okay. Um, can I change the weapons we're holding? Seeker's research. I can hardly wait. Oh, I should strengthen the healer? Okay. My assignment for you is to develop the healer. From the looks of it, there's still progress to be made. I have to get the healer to level 10. 
Um, and then I guess maybe they'll show us more of this. Wait, what is this? A magic formula apparently written by the king. It's entitled the Royal Magic, but it's written in a language I can't read. So we've seen this before. At the end of the document, the word says Hernia Guy. According to Moore, it's a person's name. Just to be sure, the Royal Magic is the spell that got invoked at the Royal Funeral, right? And this is its formula. That does seem to be the case. Put another way, the king had a detailed plan to ensure how things would play out before he died at Luis's hand. The kind of a stupid plan if it involves giving your son's murderer a chance to take the throne. I don't see the logic. In the 785 years that, the U that Ukronia has endured, there has only been a few instances where the king has invoked this magic. A strong desire of some sort surely spurred his decision. I believe there is still secrets to be found, a reason that his script exists. And for the name that a drawing uh, and for the name and drawing at the end. What a strange feeling I'm getting. Now that I consider it again, I feel as if I've seen this somewhere before. Why would I feel this way? It's certainly not a language used anywhere in the kingdom. Hey, you okay? Indeed. It certainly seems there is not as much I cannot recall. Should you learn anything new, I would appreciate it very much if you'd share it with me. Yeah, okay, so... So this scroll is slowly gonna, like, uh, unveil itself throughout the game. It's conceivable. I still cannot help but feel I've forgotten something important pertaining to the script. Adieu. Interesting. Can I examine it? How do I examine it? It's oh, I, I'm examining it there. Okay, okay. Um, I'm so curious as to what this guy's... What's going to happen. Yes, that's right. So they want the Royal Scepter. The Royal Scepter is like the nuke. So we can't let them uh, get their hands on it. Uh, no healer for that. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go no healer. Well, not for the other dungeon. I'll, I'll definitely um, switch up. But let me see if I can... Let's try. Kind of cool. I'm, uh, I'm super interested in that guy. I think more has to be bad. <laughs> Oh, okay. We can't head there at night, though. Right, -o. That makes sense. Um, keep pressing the wrong button for the map. Let's um. Let's head there right away. Holy shit! I did. That was fucking crazy. The Liam Payne news. Can I make, um... Oh, I didn't have all the ingredients. Okay, that's fine. You're a big... Yeah. All right, I'll just cook. You're a big... All right, we're just going to help her in the kitchen. Next up is... We finished preparing the fish, so now we just have to put these in the pot. Then... Next thing we need to prepare is the cockatoo woolly cloud omelette. The eggs in this dish are supposed to have a fluffy looking texture. How do we do that? Whoa, cook on low heat. Cook on low heat, right? Or use less oil? Isn't it cook on cook on low heat? Does anyone know? Anyone know how to cook? We need the eggs to be fluffy. I don't think. How much oil would you be using normally? I try not to use much oil at all. I think it's low heat, right? This is not a cook. We need to cook over a low heat. Okay. So we let the residual heat slowly finish the eggs. Gotcha. Time to get started. Please, please, did we cook? Pour our hearts into preparation. Ah, let's go! The technique using low heat allowed the eggs to develop a soft and airy texture. Nice job. The customer wolfed down the whole plant. You're surprisingly good at this. Thank you, I know. I know, I know. Alright. Hey, yeah, yeah, we're fucking we're kinda good at cooking. Shit, I'm still racist though. Okay. Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws nearer. 
All right. There's no time. We're running out of time. Yeah, we're running out of time, but I'm going to go help my future wife. So let's go do that. Let's head there right away. Going to go help my future wife. It is what it is. What's happened? Oops, sorry. Dude, I, I really struggle with the binds in this area. I always, I need to like invert them, but I know if I do invert them, I'm going to fucking start using the old binds. I'm at the, the boss, I think. I'm at the, or the first boss. Um, you can see how many days are required. Oh shit, okay. If the road there doesn't pass through an encampment, you can get there that afternoon. When you return to town from your destination, it will be night. After tackling a dungeon, you won't be able to do anything else. Okay, the wilds outside contain innumerable threats. Trust in your allies. Let's see. You want to marry me? What the fuck? Wait, am I, am I too early? How many days? One. Let's see here. A shooter? What the fuck is a shooter? Hey, it's your call. What did she say? Just to give us some thought. There and back within a day. Let's move. Fuck it, dude. Hey, it should be okay, man. I'll use my uh, my giga brain. The party at last found themselves at the Lega Corridor. Once a palace of a small bygone country oh, fuck you, destroyed and worn away by sand and rock. The land is a shadow of its former glory. Now it is home to monsters attracted by its stagnant magma. The party steps into the corridor, as if called there by the lingering resentment of a country they could not stand. Is the game loud enough, guys? Alright, beautiful. The thing is. Am I am I here too early? Do you reckon? Crispy much? The one million much? Oh damn! The wall? Have you not seen this, dude? Hold on. Rumbling, rumbling, da da. I right, Levi's still there. Levi's on my back. Levi's on my back. This is where Brigida mentioned. Apparently the monster here sometimes attacks personal buyers. Hey, does anyone when they see that waiting emote, the emote Tay used just before, does that not look like a little Caesars motherfucker or something? Yo, what's up, Susan? I had no idea these were here. This is a villa for the grand old noble family. A grand old noble family, I heard. But this looks properly old. Well, at any rate, we're here for the Guptaros. The ruins here are novel. Yes, but let's not stray from our purpose. Let's look... For it's hunt for rare treasure. There might be rare treasure about. This place is huge. Getting sidetracked isn't a good idea. My bad. My bad, my bad. You're wearing a Levi's shirt right now? Wait. I have a Levi's shirt, but my breasts are too big right now to wear it. All right. Retaking the cathedral is our priority, but furthering our strength is useful as well. All right, bad, bad, bad. Let's do it. I've been well, Susan. Should we try somewhere else? All right. Well then, if so. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Everything's pretty standard. Everything's pretty standard. Why did this happen? Oh, I wasn't expecting those vicious monsters. How could? Wait, is this is this area gonna be hard? No, Gaborns. I defeated one easily. And then the Gaborns, wielding all kinds of weapons, started flooding out. Before I knew it, I was surrounded by all manner of Gaborns. God, just thinking about it makes my knees weak. I just want to give up and go home. These wait, they look like fun. Oh. Right there. Time for some close this could be our I don't know if stunning both of them does anything. Alright. What are we doing? Apparently they're weak to slash. Here? Didn't see that week. Did they never justice? That's what I'm saying. Ooh! All right. What do we got here? He's stunned though. Yep. Fuck you. Bye, I'm doing good, man. I've been freaking loving metaphor. Okay. I don't think there's any more backup coming. Thank you, Galica. 
Back up, beautiful. There they are. Well, there's definitely one on my right. There we go. What's up, Milky? Oh, they all come down. All right, bet. Um, do I want to like do a team attack? Horse drawn carnage deals heavy physical strike to one enemy. I don't think I need to do that. It's definitely going to be a waste of my mana. But I guess I'm supposed to finish this whole area in one day, so maybe it doesn't even matter. I'm going to see what it looks like. The duo attack. Oh, shit! <laughs> Fucking poor goblin, man. Poor goblin. There's something I should know? Literally tell me. Da -da -da -da. No, 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 no. Recover from stun? That's fine. Wait, really? I genuinely thought I would have killed them with three attacks. I missed. Clown. Alright. Oh my god! Oh my god! Did I, 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 the weather. I, re I remember someone saying that like magic is stronger in bad weather or something, or it's worth more. Oh shit! So I came here in at a bad time. I came here during shit weather, so I'm not getting extra attacks on my critical hits. Oh fuck! Oh, that's fucking grief. I love making the game harder for myself. Oh, no way. Okay. That's right. That'll do it. That'll do. Yep, we're safe. Hello, Diente. Oh, I can talk to the tooth? Talkative tooth. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> hey, kiddo. Which weapon are you using? Ha, huh, it talked. You think a tooth can't chatter by itself? Well, chew on this. I've got a jaw, I've got jaw dropping news for you guys. Depending on your weapon, your attack power is totally going to change. Okay, we fucking knew that. Oh, but it's important for magic too. The strength of magic depends on your weapon, you know? Chew on that for a while. Anyway, if your enemies are taking big bites out of you, bite back with better weapons. Go shopping or something. That's the truth of the tooth. You're very knowledgeable. Well, that's enough from me now. Wouldn't want to bite off more than you can chew. Next time, I'll teach you some secrets you can really sink your teeth into. Oh, bet. Oh, we get extra XP. That's badass. Did I, I fuck with the tooth, man. It's all clear. Alrighty. Everything's pretty standard. What's down here? Oh shit. Well, I don't know if there's more to check out over here. Am I supposed to be going lower or higher? It's all clear. I'm used to climbing. I'm not used to uh descending. Alright, still, they're still not... Oh, there's three of them? What the fuck? Yeah, I'm not getting extra turns. That's actually not guarded. Uh, I'm going to... Draw attacks to... I saw you go live, then hopped on my PC, then forgot you were live and hopped on... <laughs> Fucking crazy. What's up, bro? Uh... Oh, I just blocked him, idiots. What's up, Trippy? How are you? Oh, what GPUs you got? What did you end up with? Oh, yeah, they were going with the 7900? Very nice, very nice. What does that come through? Think we're in the clear. Okay. Alright, let's fly through this. Fly, fly, fly. Right. There's nothing about Gaborns around here that make... Uh, there's no, there's nothing but Gaborns around here. So many novice adventurers come to this place looking to test their metal. Some fool had the idea to bring in a staff or mace igniters. You wouldn't be so daft, would you? You can't ever let a Gaborn see one of those. If you do, they launch into a frenzy as soon as they see your weapon. Damn. 
stunning hour. When I share for the switch. There they are. Let's take them all out. Ross has a million hours in this game. I can pass my turn here. Dude, I saw Sarai already has 45 hours in this shit. Dude, their game came out two days ago. Oh, let's go stroll. Oh, I used wind damage. That's fucking the best. Let's pass. Are you prepared? I can almost finish. I'm using a lot of mana. I'm kind of nervous about mana. Stun. Sorry, guys. That's what I'm saying. Vanquishing evil? W. Critical strike? Fuck you. Holy shit. Oh, there's still two? Russ, do you know if auto heal pulls heals from your, um... Do you know if heals... Auto heal pulls heals from your inventory or if it's like a, a mana thing? Like... So, but, dude, it is fire, man. It's fucking fire, guys. The whole playthrough is on the VOD channel if you guys want to catch up. It's fucking badass. The story's really good. What if racism boosts my stats to the max? I'd be a lot stronger right now. I, I'd definitely be one-hitting things. So that's kind of weird. It uses MP. Okay. How are you doing, Vessel? Oh. Coffee's not working for you? Right there. Come on. I feel like coffee is honestly like placebo for me at this point. I don't, I don't think caffeine really has an effect on me. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Let's let's be a little bit cheeky here. Let's make him. Oh, slash damage to all enemies. Two turns though. That's kind of fucking diabolical. Some people are just. I mean, Rose literally drinks coffee to fall asleep. I drank Red Bull the other day. Okay, hold on. Red Bull does have an effect on me, man. Or G subs. Exclamation mark G subs. Oh, here we go. Maybe, you know what? I think luck. I'm going to put my luck up. I'd love to have more items. I'd love to get mana items. Okay, I'm a high enough level now so I can just kill these guys. I don't have to enter turn based combat. Guarded. Oh, I still do. I lied. What a Red Bull without the vodka? <laughs> Dude, you might you might have a problem if you're saying it tastes like vodka Red Bull without the Red Bull. <laughs> without the vodka, sorry. That's a crazy way to describe the taste of fucking Red Bull. I'm doing good, Vessel. Having a good time playing this. Chatting with chat. I don't mind these combat areas, yeah, because I can talk to you guys. Drank so much coffee in my life that you'd have to drink three to have an effect. I never go over a double a day. I can only do a double shot in one day. Um, or else I'm scared I will become way too resistant to it. Uh, bartender, can I get a vodka Red Bull? Hold the vodka. I got you, man. I'll put a lime in that shit to make you uh, feel better about yourself. Ooh, shit. Let's go, dude. I fucking... What a good quality of life change. Mixing a rum and coke, but leaving the coke out. The same volume as well. And the coffee made you sleepy? g stops might be the player, man. No ad, no ad. Rum and coke, uh, rum and coke, rum and coke. Rum and coke is my trauma. Shit, did fuck all too. Yeah, no, nah, G-Stops is different, man. Oh, here we go. Witch's earrings. Earrings that slightly augments magical power. Magic plus three. Oh, I believe I got a um a sword that I could give to Hulkenberg, no? Iron Lance, no. Maybe Protagonist, Bronze Machete. Whoa, that's twice as strong, man. What the forge? Anyone about order or anything whimsical or odd when you were bartending? Um, honestly, not really, because it was like a very... Our clientele at the bar I worked at, everyone was kind of like 
in their in their 40s and 50s. So nothing too strange. I had someone, I think, not even that weird, but I had someone come in and order, um, what are they called in English? Not Michelada, Michelada. I mean, it's not even the same thing, I think. Bloody Marys. Someone came in on a Sunday alone. They look, they looked really hungover and they just ordered, um, three Bloody Marys. Oh fuck, we got ambushed. They ordered three Bloody Marys. My aid, okay. And they just down one Bloody Mary after another. I was like, what the fuck is wrong with you? I did. I actually did fight the dragon. So Stroll has that weapon. Okay, yeah, no, they weren't my age. But I was getting fucking... I was getting borderline groomed by motherfuckers. I just turned 18, though. I think, right? Did I? Okay, this is really bad. This is really bad. This is really, really bad. I just realized we all got fucked. I think I have to heal us. Am I really? Oh my god. Oh wait. I can't even rewind the battle, man. Just the thing. I live to see another day. Oh, that kind of sucks. You can't go there anymore. Okay. Thank God they used that uh, shitty. Fuck, do I kill this? Okay, I do. Pass. Woo! The crit. Uh, Jesus, where can I get that at a possible 10% discounted rate? Does anyone, does, does anyone here, like, not drink coffee? Because I envy. It probably has, like, a, a crazy effect on you. But yeah, it's, it's so weird how some people are just, like, not receptive to caffeine. Okay, I kind of trolled here. I have no, like... What does blue cheese do? 150? 50 HP to all allies. Hey, 100 to all allies. Yikes. Right there. Oh, so you were just, like, born that way, then. I'll fuck up a decal for the taste. Oh, so you like the taste? A lot of people don't like the taste of coffee. I fucking love the taste of coffee. Coffee gives you heart palpitation? Oh, shit. I can slash. Let's take oh, it sorts so much better. Looks like that's all of them. Great job, gang, 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 gang! Unscathed but triumph. It. it feels good to get stronger. Oh, it really does, bro. You're so fucking sexy. Sorry, bro. Where am I going? Oh, I'm going. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? I'm going back. Oh, wait, wait, actually true. Someone, wait, someone said that earlier. Wait, is that a sign of ADHD? If you drink coffee and you get tired? Can you taste the decaf? How do they actually take the caffeine out of the fucking coffee, man? No, not this. How does that even work? Okay, I thought that was going to do more damage. NGL. Let me help. Let's increase the attack of him. Pass my turn. No holding back. Diagonal slash. Nice. Did he just die? Oh no. Can I get an extra turn here? No. Are you prepared? Pack and slash. Than I thought. Liquid suicide. Okay, there's there's a lot more shit that's probably that's the last of them. literally uh fucking the equivalent of killing yourself drinking it. But it does increase your heart rate for sure. That should come in handy. Pocket it. Pocket it. Where am I? Oh fuck, that's not the floor I'm on. Death by coffee, embarrassing? Dude, Loki, though, what a way to go out. Holy crap. That, that, like, fucking... That cadaver would just smell so good, not gonna lie, man. Holy fuck. I have nothing to change the subject with. My bad. Um... 
Oh, did you guys see that? Isn't it like a coffee that's like made from cat poop? Hey. Fucking delectable cadaver. Sometimes I should get the caffeine free G subs. Right there. It's just low key, honestly. It's like the, there, there are those memes where it's like, bro, why are you buying G subs if like you don't like do anything during the day? Like, it's just a game. Which I kind of agree with, but I do need caffeine if I'm going to be like streaming and stuff. But if not, well, I don't need caffeine, but uh, it's nice. But then if you're doing other stuff, having caffeine definitely helps if you like thinking. Cadaver dude on TikTok. I actually have got that on my For You page, the cadaver dude on TikTok. Coffee made my mushrooms. That sounds kind of, I mean, fuck. Damn, I just took a shit ton of that. I don't, I don't get these blue things. I can't kill them. Can I not lock on? Oh shit. Whoa! Right there. I think I need to kill the shitters first. Yeah, like cow poop coffee or something. This is a coffee that's like they I think they eat the beans first or some shit. I actually can't remember. I could be completely lying. I definitely have to heal Stroll. I stand ready. I don't know, but people are crazy. I mean, they have that cheese in Italy that's literally just fucking maggots. Like, bruh. Go on now. Hope you the what? Is that what it is? Am I dead before this dungeon's finished? Dude, I, I need more MP. I need MP production. Asian palm civets. Bro, what? Oh, look at, look at gang. Gang, 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 gang. There they are. Clash of clans, goblins. You're so fucking right. Hello, gatito. Record my journey. Muchas gracias. Yep. Thank you, Pluto. Um, yeah, fuck, all right. All right. Uh, looks like the Goop Taurus is up ahead. Are you ready? Honestly, I'm gonna be so fucking real with you. I'm not. Let's, um, what am I doing? Hernia boy? 20 MP? I'm using both of them. Gonna be honest. Gonna use both of them. Um... All right, he has ability power now. It, yeah, it's different. So instead of one dungeon like in Persona, yeah, one dungeon like in Persona 3 where you keep climbing the stories, it's different dungeons. So you go into like different kingdoms. Whoever found out they can make coffee out of fecal matter should not be allowed outside. <laughs> That's how insane as hell. Wait, did he have a, did he have a dick? Cortisol levels are still low when waking up, so they advise to consume 40 to five, 45 to 60 minutes after you wake up. Oh, for coffee. Oh, actually, I've heard of that. That's real, guys. What uh, Ajax just said. I think I normally do that. I normally sip my coffee. Watch out. Oh, he's actually he actually is kind of hung. All right, so let me think. What am I doing? I think for my first move, I'm gonna apparently defending against this guy doesn't really do Jesus. shit. I'm gonna pass. Okay. Increase the attack damage of Stroll. Then I'm going to... I have a full other move. I'm going to... Taunt him. Draw all attacks to my... Knight. Um... And then we're going to use a regular attack. Wait, no. What is this guy weak to? Pierce. Holy shit. Wait, this guy was weak to pierce, no? Yeah, she has the piercing weapon. I just fucking griefed. Um. Rewind. Um. 
She ate shit. Okay, hold on. I have to empower Hulkenberg. What's Hulkenberg's first name? I fucking hate her name. Synthesis. Jump thrust. Okay. And lowers the defense. Oh, 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 oh. Holy shit. What? That did nothing! What the fuck? What? Hello? After me! No. I pass it's okay. and increase Hulkenberg's attack again. Let me help. Let me... Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Nice. Not now. From our provisions. I live to see another day. Oh, you've done it. Can anyone heal him? My best wasn't enough. Kissable Minotaur? Oh my god, do I have to come here tomorrow? So, fantasy is only fiction. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Did I lose all those items I just used? No, okay. Okay. I guess I came here on the wrong day. I don't think I can fight him because of the weather. What? Do I just fucking leave? In that case, Let's head back. Oh my. I I can't like teleport straight there, can I? Oh, who are you? Oh. <laughs> Dude, I, I wish I read this earlier. Planning on going inside, are you? Well, here's some friendly advice. Don't. Okay, well, at least when I come back, I'll be high enough level to just kill everything. I did technically just waste the whole day, didn't I, though? Although I... I wait, I just went in. What the fuck? I did a lot of, um... The first dungeon. Early. Yeah, it's kind of grief, man. Actually throwing. I wonder if I need... Wait, uh... What's the um what's the the next boss week to? I probably should keep using healer. Okay, I actually did just kinda throw, guys. I did kinda just throw. Alright. It's nearly time. The day of calamity is in four days. If he's calling his next act calamity, there's no doubt he means something truly horrific. Whatever it is, we have to stop him. We don't have much time, but I know you can do it with those new powers. Mm. I thought myself utterly exhausted, but this meal is delectable. I shall sleep well after such a feast. I'd say we earned our rest today. Good job. Mom, I threw up. I haven't played Hades 2 yet. Gonna play it when it fully releases, I think. Time marches on. I, unless it's like a game I'm super, super excited for. I normally don't play um, early access games. Yeah, definitely I'll play it when it comes out. We should hurry. Um, okay, I might have to go up and do the fights. Let me just... Uh... I'm going to go to the cathedral. I, will, I swear I will actually go back to sleeping dogs. I freaking promise. Until dawn, I think I'm going to play the old one. Apparently the old one's better. We're going to go back to healer. Uh, does he want me to talk to him? Does he want me to say something here? Like inherit skills or lectures? What is that arrow next to his name? Yes, that's right. Fast. I think I'm just gonna play the OG. The new one kind of had like an uncanny look to the characters. I don't know. They were like a little bit too realistic. Alright. Alright, so I think I'm at the top of this. Or at least... You know what? I'm probably only halfway actually now that I think about it. 
Um, there's a Mongla Hollow right behind us. That's what makes the most spooky is fucking crazy. Uh, travel elsewhere. Servant's Chamber. Which one's higher? Wait. Which one is actually higher? I don't even know. I, I assume the one it put me in would be the one that's higher up, maybe? They saw There's something about um Wait, are we gonna be able to have four party members? It's no, it's normally three, yeah. No, it's only four, right? In in percent of three. Alright. Oh fuck, I probably should have healed. Oh, this isn't it. Yeah, okay. White clad soldier, I see you little rats have come at last. If you didn't flee, I take it you have a death wish, hmm? The white uniform. You must be a white clad, vile fiend. You know what is happening below, yet you choose to forsake your soldiers. The rank and file are of no importance to me. I was instructed to leave them be. Bastards, you said you protect those who follow you. You treat your own soldiers as pawns. Fork tongued snakes. Silence. Great, cause, great causes require sacrifice. How do you expect the people to come to their senses without pain? I'm sure there's more than a few people who are secretly pleased besides. Lord Luis had laid waste, has laid waste to the bastion of rot called the Sanctus Church. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I forgot that. Luis doesn't like the church. It's kind of based. Are you getting a bit of lag? Is stream lagging? For me, it's fine. For me, it's fine right now. That's kind of based. Oh shit, hold on. How absurd. This is naught but slaughter. On my honor, on my mama. I will put an end to this, even if I must do it by force. Yeah, we kill these motherfuckers. I I think the knight is actually quite limiting. I don't really like the knight. Okay, I did make a pretty bad call here. I shouldn't have skipped this move here. I skipped this move earlier. And it was just not a good idea. So I think here, here. we go to Hunkleberg. Hunkleberg. And then I also... I, I should have known this guy was going to be weak to this. Oh, now I get another move with Stroll. Oh, and I can hit Let's my synthesis, right? Yep. Yeah, okay, here we go. Moment of truth. Let's finish this. Yeah, it's... I mean, I in Persona, I think I died twice. In this... I mean, definitely I've died a few times to because the binds are different. I've accidentally passed my turn or like I've accidentally um, pressed the wrong button. But um, even with those deaths, like kind of not accounted for, I've died a lot just from fucking playing. Is that some tube? I don't think some tube. Oh, okay, I see. Wait, th it's bad weather again right now. No. Right, it's like, dude, on YouTube, it does, but yeah, that's that's how it is. Let me rethink this. Um, me I think I got a synthesis, honestly. Yeah. Raising all ally attacks might be goaded. Being able to switch on the fly is kind of cool. Kind of like Persona, I guess. Like, Persona, if you see someone has... Like, here I can't, like, really... Okay, I'm probably dead here if I don't res, right? Like, I don't think my attack's gonna do shit. Because I'm not gonna, like... I might get stuck in a trap of just razzing enemies, razzing allies here. Oh, he's concentrating. On what? Okay. 
Pause my turn. Fuck, she doesn't have a, a synthesis move here, though. Oh, wait, what's he gonna do? Hold on. One elemental attack. Is he gonna use magic? Yeah, I might have to restart. He's about to use magic, right? Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna try this. Magic guard. We're gonna block his charged attack, whatever he's charging. Oh, that's hard. Oh, shit! What's he cooking? Take this. Chilling, alright, bet. You can't fight it. Is that what he was charging before and I didn't realize? Wake up. We're gonna pass. Do I just hit him normally? Fuck, I couldn't. Okay. Let's make an end of it. No. Um Let's try this. Oh, and he gets another turn as well? Wait, that's kind of fucking huge. I'm using all my shit right now, but... Kind of need to. This shit is cooked. Oh, we can just do this again? Oh, wait, wait, right. But it's... I'm not out of this yet. After me. How about, what's medium HP? Oh, healing light. That helped. I'm obliged. Oh my fucking god! Wait, death. what? And I still get another move? Here. Let's finish this. Enough. All right, concentrating again. I still don't know what this concentrating bullshit is. I'm gonna protect us all though. The power I call upon royal power within. Not now. Persona 6 attack on Titan. That literally. Yes. Let's get on with it. You know it. I'm just gonna hit him with this. I, yeah, I looked at I just noticed that. That used a lot of MP. <laughs> I just noticed that when I couldn't use anything else. So I'm about to drop a fucking big move as well. I'm about to drop a big turd on this guy. Oh, I just fucking griefed. Oh my god, I thought I didn't have enough to do this again. Whoops. Didn't count properly. We're fine, though. Yeah, do it again, you fucking idiot. Tells you where the next attack will go. Oh, wait, actually? Oh, that heals everyone? I actually didn't even know that healed everyone. You well? I knew you'd help. Plus me. Dude, it's a decent amount. God damn. Go dead. The enemy. Oh, I probably could have boosted my attack. I'm fucking so troll. You can get the last hit, my friend. Alright, this game is for nerds. I can't be corny. Let me know when you're back on, on League of Legends. Cooling stuff. Glow igniter. Light dodge increases evasion against light attacks. <laughs> Alright. Pretty tough anyway though. We somehow managed though. All this means uh, is the necromancer is much closer. Let's keep up. Fuck. How much wait, what level's my my uh my my healer at? That's true. Let me go to academia. Let me, uh, wait. What now? Stroll did get... No, hold on. Wait, what did we just freaking get? Oh, it was a, it was a staff, no? Rank 9. Dude, I needed to get to rank 10. <sighs> Go back to reality. I need to get need to get it to rank ten, man. Um, uh, okay. Resume exploring. Okay. 
I think once I get it to rank 10, I'm going to freaking switch to something else. Coil Plateau is actually a goaded character. I reckon, dude, I have... I reckon there's something that's like very wrong with more. I reckon wrong, uh, more. Death's got imprisoned by the king and used to be like a really bad guy and just had his memories wiped because like he was like a super talented mage or something. And then the cat is like one of his mates from his life or something. Let's focus on getting to the top, getting this over with. Is an item? I don't think I have. Like, for what? Oh, to level them up? Wait, what the fuck is this? Wait, what were these things? A oh, week two. Uh, I think, yeah, Slash didn't do shit. It was wind, right? Okay. You first. Come forth, royal soul. Seeker. Holy crap. I think I'm getting used to this. So I can level an archetype up, wait. Oh, I forgot about this. What the fuck? Did that even do anything? Very subtle. Yeah. What do you what do you guys have your characters as? I mean I assume you guys would have like more. Probably not even rocking. Well, well. Well, you've developed the healer. It seems your assignment is complete. Incredible. I strengthened the healer archetype to rank 10, completing my assignment. Increases imagination. Alright. Imagination. Hmm. Hmm. As I thought, I sense a sudden light in my mind illuminating what was hidden. Fascinating. Thanks to the research and strength and influence of your archetype, a flicker of memory is returning to me. Who, who are you again? Well, You actually make jokes like that? Okay, I, I misread that, honestly. I thought it was who, who you are again. <laughs> I assume that was meant in jest, but about my memory. It occurs to me that I conducted research on archetypes in the past as well. When interacting with a follower or ally, giving them a response that moves their heart, you may obtain mag. Oh, I fucking hit the wrong one. Try to be as open and receptive as possible to your followers' feelings when communicating with them. Oh, should I have... Should I have not done that? It is precisely this power that could make a real utopia like my novelized vision. Yes, it is more than feasible. Uh, however. however, that fool of a king turned his eye from the utopia I dreamt of. The book you carry and this, li and this, uh, and this library's vast knowledge all condemned by his decree. Ultimately, I was locked in these chambers, shut away in secret, and most outrageously killed and have been alone ever since except for my feline companion plateau of course i believe i would die here never knowing who i was i believed he believed it was because of that fear that i immersed myself in research i hoped that i might leave some proof that i once live yet that too became standstill that too came to a standstill and then you appeared you have given me an opportunity to not just research again but to regain my life frankly i hesitated to expect anything at all if we saw no developments here, I was prepared to finally give up. But the miracle of my memory returning has convinced me, this power of archetypes, it is the original magic, and it may shake the foundation of all we know. It can change the world. Who'll like that? It can change the world, and I'll prove it. Oh, he fucked with that so hard! Let's go! And I can already see we make- I, I can already see we will make a fine team. As for your part, You'll be needing a power that can oppose Luis. Let us continue our research further that you might reach the apex of your abilities. I can feel Moore's mild expectations and trust. But like, why would the king lock him up, man? Did he have like some kind of deranged vision of that? Re Seeker's alignment reduces the mag cost of studying the Seeker lineage. Skion skill, Scion skill, increases skill inheritance slots for the Seeker lineage to two. Uh, Moore's Magic Igniter. The archetype tree becomes accessible from the main menu. How delightful. Hey, but that's what I was saying. Well, okay. 
It appears that nurturing archetypes uh, result in a deeper bond between you and academia as well. How you doing, Dave? Hope you're doing good. I believe you are now at the point where you'll find use in this. It's an igniter that will allow you and I as fellow seekers to share our consciousness even when we're apart. This linked right igniter here. so as long as you have this you can study archetypes from anywhere you'd like however when you have completed a research task i would still ask that you come to me directly in academia all right cool that's uh that's good i do require your power in developing my my research not to mention i value the time i get to spend with speaking to you oh thank you more to change the world we must examine things from a different angle your next research task is to study the heroic embodiment of the gunner if you haven't yet acquired the gunner, perhaps you'll need to form a bond with someone more mechanically minded. I'm sure it will help you hone your virtues along with other, any other meaningful opportunities. This one's important. All right. No deadline. Like a demon it's or a furry? Strange. Kind of. Honestly, yeah, except for me. We're, we're like not, and people hate us because we're not a furry. Ah, marvelous. Already I can barely contain my fascination. My mind erases for the first time in ages. I'm counting on you. All right, bet more. Okay. Furries unite. Silent. What's good? Hello. Um, so what the fuck I just get? I've done nothing to like upgrade this shit. I'm going to be real. Like skill inheritance. Right. So I can go. Let me, um. Dude, Loki stroll. Like that dragon blade is so fucking crazy, man. I think I have to keep him on this. Oh, right. He inherits it from the other ones. Okay. What is this thing weak to? Archetype details. Weak to wind. Okay. Um, if I had like a, a wind dodge, that'd be cool. I mean, it's, it's nice to have magic damage in this dungeon. So I'll give him magic damage. So he's got that. Um, Hulkenberg. I mean, honestly, I don't really fuck with the knight. Brawler looks badass. I see. Brawler looks freaking badass, man. And then, yeah, that, that's actually kind of troll. The bro do some characters do better with certain archetypes? Um, do some yeah? Do some characters work better with certain archetypes, or is it just kind of whatever? What is this emote? Dude, I I did I add it? We have the other Tay one. Wait, I actually think I have slots. Um, right here. Its heroic embodiment is that of the independent truth hunter, the earnest heart who sees the potential in all, striving for even greater heights alongside them. So this is from Kat Kat Katharina. Kind of because of their stats. Wh where are their stats? Hold on. How do I see like Hulkenberg's stats? Zest, I hope you're doing good. Party thing. What now? Right. Okay. So some. Wait. You're totally right. Some are like physically inclined. Some us. What is hers? What the fuck? What is N again? Right, I might not use the brawler yet. Defense. I'm not. Yeah, I'm not gonna use the brawler yet. I'll keep her as the knight. Um. Mm. I do want to inherit some kind of skill here, unless I make him the brawler. I I give him brawler. I guess like uh, main character, you can give them everything. I'm gonna inherit brawler on. Uh, sorry. Right here. All right. Learn brawler on main character. I'm counting. Of course. I have a shit ton of magla anyway. Just so that if I do run out of um, mana, I can use uh, this. I hear the voices of past hero souls, O worthy heart who tempers anxiety into strength. If thou art prepared to expend thine own vitality and plunge into the fury of battle, then I shall bestow upon thee our soul, the soul of the brawler. So this is the power of the brawler's soul. I can feel the nobility of expending one's own life to fight. I'll continue to fight, even if it means putting my life on the line. The brawler archetype is awakened. You can now change from the main menu. Okay, so... Yeah. Uh, channel? Nope! Are we good? So, skill inheritance. So, let's see if we can inherit. Yeah, so deals weak physical strike. Uh, proportional to the caster's remaining HP. 
Fade Zero, is it actually? Yeah, that game can't be this game. You know how it is. Looks like a, they kind of do look like Warframe characters, no? Having the mage on this mother sucker is kind of kind of guarded. I'm a door man. You can have everything. Anyone calling out tomorrow? I need uh, someone to set a bad example for me. I'm calling out, guys. No stream tomorrow. Kidding. I hear the voices of past heroes. A worthy heart who tempers anxiety into strength. If thou art prepared to pursue knowledge that surpasses the natural logic of the world, I shall bestow upon thee our soul, the soul of the mage. For all those suffering in this land, I shall do something. All right, let's let's inherit this shit. But wheels deep fire, weak fire damage. All right, get me the fuck out of here. Wait, let's talk to the cat. Plateau, hello. His fur is so soft and clean. Makes me curious how he takes care of it. Oh, he's licking his shit. He's licking his shit. All right, let's go back to reality. Oh, then it kind of is like that then. Brute do they be punching. Oh, okay, block from the other side. Oh, here's the elevator. What? Is this wall made of magla? I doubt we can get through that. It's a type of barrier magic. I've never seen a miasma wall of this size though. Look. But look inside. Isn't that a lift? It is. You think it works? There'd be no reason to put a barrier up if it didn't. If we can deal with the wall, we should be able to reach the very top of the cathedral. This miasma looks similar to the one we saw in the mausoleum underground. Does that mean there's a crystal producing it? Oh, we gotta go destroy the crystal. Let's see. Who? Fruit Punch is actually, I don't really like Fruit Punch. I would, no, not really. It's kind of, it's, I don't know. I don't like juice that has too many fruits in it. What the? That must be what's causing the magic barrier. I hate to admit it, but the necromancer is quite a powerful mage. Yo, Brian, thank you for the raid, man. Thank you guys. Please welcome Brian and the Raiders. How was your stream, dude? Uh, it was nice to meet you, dude. Brian is a really, really good uh, Final Fantasy Online streamer, guys. So good, in fact, that he was... He's American. I, th I think you live in America, right? Um, he came down to Australia to sh play Final Fantasy at PAX. How badass is that? So I met him at PAX and I met him at TwitchCon as well. Uh, guys, give him a follow. Yeah, yeah, he was, he was there. It was badass. Uh, how was your stream, man? Hope it was good. Uh, Mavius, thank you for the follow. We're just playing... Um, we're just playing, what's it called? Uh, Metaphor Refantasio. I don't know if you guys have heard of it, but it is, uh, this is, like, this is a JRPG, right? Um, we've got like our squad and we're just going through a dungeon right now, killing a bunch of uh, creatures to find a necromancer. Um, and yeah, it's pretty good. Did you win? There's no winning in Final Fantasy. It's just constant grind. The win is the, uh, the journey along the way. Oh, okay. It's kind of badass. <laughs> element of absolute element absolution. Mm, that might be Vegemite, you gotta have Vegemite with a little bit of butter on it. Vegemite with a bit of butter. Uh, you have to have butter. Or cheese. Did I wish I got fucking MP back in these areas, dude? The lack of MP is fucking doing my head in. Let's go. Uh, Umbreon, 1423-3567. Thank you for the follow. Get me. Don't get I don't know legs. what the fuck that is. Right there. What the fuck Break is that yourself. thing? Curse will kill me. What the fuck just happens? I shall vanquish evil. Back for attacks until it's gone. Oh, Wait, light. if we get hexed? The curse. I won't hold back. Fire. Stay sharp. It's not a real threat. To you. No holding back. The attack? He's getting hurt too. Kill 
kill a boss with items? Wait, that motherfucker came back. Do I gotta uncurse my shit? Hold on. I shall vanquish evil. Something else. Go for it. Only two enemies left. Fish art. Fire. Just one left. The most dreadful. No, but I love pickles. I freaking love pickles. I shall defend. I shall staying on the defensive. Pickles are grossed. Dude, how long does this hex work? Oh, fuck. Our main guy died. Wait, none of these dudes can attack? Oh, okay. I, I, last resort? Oh, it's dead. Okay, we're chilling. I knew it was gonna kill itself next turn. Alright, I forget. Caesar salads. Understood. That's ostrich le You can get os leather from ostrich? I guess you could from like the skin. That's kind of crazy. What do you think? Is that how it works? Understood. Or feathers. Can you get leather from... Can I call Crispy? Umbra, I promise you if you give me $500, I'll literally call Crispy right away. And I'll say you said something. I promise. Like without... without. Uh, no, no stress. Um, back to the tavern, uh, thingo. Uh, at long last, the white clads emerge. Twould seem we draw close to the necromancer. A most favorable development indeed. But the royal scepter chamber is at the very top, is it not? We'll need an operable lift at minimum. Don't worry, we'll figure something out. Let's focus on pushing forwards, just like we've been yeah. doing. Indeed, we'll put a stop to this day of calamity. That much is certain. Then we'll get him to tell us where we can find Luis. It's nearly time. The day of calamity is in three days. If he's calling his next act calamity, there's no doubt he means something truly horrific. Okay, three days, easy. We got that. Get our rest. All right. Uh, yeah, I probably, I'll, I, we could probably get to the boss today. I think probably that's like one more hour. Time marches on and the age of a new king draws. Um, oh yeah, 500 bucks. Yeah, $500 and I'll call Crispy, I promise you. No joke. There's no time. That's right. Um, everything should be cheaper. Okay, let's actually let's buy some stuff. Um, yeah, I saw that. Make a five fifty. Okay, there you go. Fifty bucks is gonna go to uh to Jeff. <laughs> the fuck up, guys. Um, I think we're going back in. Let's move. Let's have a look. Actually, I saw a Christmas story was like saying he was having a really good day, right? What do you think? I didn't. I didn't listen though because I was peeing. I was frying chicken. Can I call you? Feel Shut the fuck up, Emprism. Where to? Oh, here we are. Okay. I didn't see. I didn't see. I need to. I need to look. You asked me to not thank you. <laughs> oh, to be honest, this was a boss room. Am I? Am I fully healed? Okay. Do you know what we probably should do? I just used everything on my main guy. All right. We can play simile, dude. That's what we're waiting for. I, I think yesterday we literally said all of them. It's all well. Only having one light attack. Like, okay. I mean, I, I can switch. I can switch for this and basically like get it in one, but it's kind of annoying. I have to do that, but I guess that's how it's played. Uh, so we put the healer on. Give the healer that skill inheritance. Uh, we can do... It's like a slash. Oh, actually, no, 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 no. Okay. If we do this, we'll have a multi... Like to the joke? It's alright. It's a good joke, so it's, it's valid, it's valid. Okay, so... Oh, oh, hold on. So now I should have... Yeah. Okay, see, so if I had that, I think... I think they do want you to rock the healer in this dungeon. I think having the healer in this dungeon is, uh... Oh, it's gonna block that. I forgot. 
Oh my god, and I lose half my ha I I lose Fuck. Oh, and they all last resort now, really? Oh, they do it to, to end up with two. Um Dude, it's not even worth. Are you prepared? Let's get on power support you. Alright. Yeah, when you accidentally do the wrong move, you lose two turn cycle. Two turns. It's fucking kind of crazy. She just has to block. Get the weak point. Alright, there we go. That's the spirit. Dude, they, they knew what the they knew when they made the game that this shit was gonna be really hard, so they put the retry battle button inside the uh Let's make an end of it. We'll combine our strength. Alright, here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna keep healer on. Even though I don't really fuck with the healer that much. Um Healer's got moves that are, are very, very good for this dungeon. That takes care of the monsters. We destroy the crystal. Alright, let me uh well, what's happening with this? All right. Good. Good. That should have dispelled yeah. the barrier, correct? After all that, it better have. Let's go see if the lift works. Finally. I hope that was our last obstacle. All right. What's been happening, Shadow? Shadow, were you here earlier? Am I trolling? Necromancer. It would appear the barrier has been broken and the second crystal is shattered. Surely the intruders have made their way to the, uh, haven't made their way to the upper levels. Hmm. <laughs> so corpses alone were not enough to stop them. I have little patience for rats scurrying in the shadows. Go exterminate the interlopers now. Yes. So, consider it done. And remember, failure will not be tolerated. Master Luis's army is no place for incompetence. Am I understood? Is it possible? There might be, there might be. Is it really? Nah, my days are blending again, man. Still, I can't imagine the army making it this far. But that rabble wielding unknown magics. Could it be them? No matter. It hardly matters. Whoever it is can struggle all they like. Nothing can stop the calamity to come. Okay. Sure. All right. Now then, shall we head back to the lift? Let's call it. Alrighty. Fuck, that was actually Got it. a tragic Easy. battle. Yeah. Double the size of the... God damn, what the fuck? Miasma wall is... The lift is gone? Oh my god. Wait, it's coming down. Oh, there's gonna be a sheer ton of enemies on this lift. Right? Oh, now I wish I had the other guy with Pierce. I have no Pierce right now. No. Watch out. I have no Pierce. I should have switched back. Mm. Yep, I, I don't have that, gonna be honest. What else are you guys weak to? Resist? Bro, I don't have anything for these guys. Just three solid, dude. I literally... I literally don't have shit for this. Is that all? Let me help. But me... Let justice prevail. There. Dude, that motherfucker takes no damage. He takes no damage. Huh? Let's paralyze him. It, it didn't fucking work. Cool. Cool. Alright, I'm just gonna lose this fight, man. Like, oh, dude. Hulk. Oh, dude. Hulk. 
Bro, how does she do such little damage? What the fuck? Like, it's literally... No. Alright, this is auto battle. Let's just... I'm gonna have to come here another day. This fight is just using way too much MP. Oh my god. Literally, I'm spending one day here for this fight. That fucking sucks, Megan. I'm glad that you can find some comfort here at least. But that, that, that does fucking suck. But it has to be that way. The more health I have there, actually, the more damage it does, I just realized. Oh, maybe that guy wasn't weak to it, actually. I shall vanquish evil. Staying on the defensive. Give up. Hold back. Keep pressing B for block. Will this pass it to... What's up, uh, coin? How are you? Hello, hello. How have you been today? Fuck, I actually... I, I actually high-key... Why'd I do that? Oh. oh my god, what did I just do with my move? What the fuck did I just do with my move? What the fuck did I just do with my move just then? Holy fuck. Alright, that was the worst fight ever. Cooling stuff. I fucking hated that fight so much. Maybe you're gonna rock mage. Yeah, we somehow managed to win that? Yeah, that fucking sucked. You see? What happens if we go up? At last. Yes. We're okay. Man, I, dude, I saw that emote you you put up in uh, Shady Shay yesterday. Looks like this is as far as the lift goes. Is weak to piss. Couldn't be me. What's going on in here? Hmm. This is. Uh, is this a portrait? Speaking of, I'd heard portraits of kings past were hung in the center of the grand cathedral. Fine. Look, all the portraits are discarded, and in their place, he has installed his lord Luis Zorba, that knave. Zorba? Is that his name? Sounds like you know him. No. Only in passing. Even since the early days, he's always been infamous. Luis was the only man who paid no mind to his reputation and took him under his wing. Infamous for what? Infamous for what? Uh, early, in my, early in my knighthood, he was an army engineer. He had some true skill in magic that, would, that could animate the inanimate, but his raw offensive spells were pitifully weak. His past won him no favors. Lowborn family and half-blood of the Mustari pagans besides. Another outcast for the army. Only Luis saw potential in his powers of animation. It was a subtle art, but one with vast utility even puppeteering the dead as you saw. Okay, so he's, yeah, this is um the, the necromancer, obviously. Uh, he must have become utterly devout, uh, devoted to Luis. The Zorba I knew was an earnest young man, if rather withdrawn. So it's not strategic. He puts the painting up out of sheer worship. There are a few things so dangerous as a zealot. This is a lot. Let's stay on our guards. So he like, fuck, he worships this mother sucker, man. All right, all right, bet, bet, bet. Um, Mum was up at 5 a.m. finding them uh, from flying away. Didn't everything, but got five, fe wait. Oh my God, wait, you have like really bad winds? Portraits of the royal line have been abandoned. They're riddled with holes. So he was fucking the other kings? No way. The fence panels were flying away. That's how windy it was. Dude, I can't believe how much I struggled in that fight. I think I actually might be challenged. You know what? I'm so good not fighting. He's here. Whoa! Well, okay, well. I didn't want to fight him now. I truly didn't expect you to make it this high. I applaud your resilience, if nothing else. The sanctuary was all but flooded with Magla. Zorba, was that your doing? You've heard of me then. Well, considering Lord Luis's influence, I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Tell us, 
Those bizarre magla crystals. They shouldn't naturally form in a place like this. Are you responsible for them? Hmm? Oh, you mean the Melancholia crystals? All I did was place a passable core or two along the path to make it easier for them to form. Melancholia crystals? Yes, little more than a parlor trick to block your path. I just realized this guy has an eye on his head. He, yeah, he's part of the um from Moats of Magla. Dorito clan. So it was just one possible crystallization of it. One that drives mortals to madness. <laughs> Speak sense. You claim this horrific aberration is something natural. That you had only the barest hand in its power? Melancholia, pure and simple. The result of pure magla at its most dense. Man or beast, any wretch who feels its power will go berserk. They'll see anyone as a threat. Some have their bodies hardened like scales. Some their very bones twist inside them until there's something else entirely. Melancholia, huh. what are you trying to achieve? It's the oh, kind of hectic, right? Isn't it? You the house fucking flying away. Questions. I'm afraid I haven't the time for answers. There is much yet to prepare. Hey, I'm not done talking to you. Huh? You've done nothing but talk. Perhaps you should have listened instead. Whoa. Is this a piece of bone? I had to find some use for the scattered pieces I couldn't animate into soldiers. And now I have three more fools to grind down for the pile. Look out! Take cover! Ugh. Don't fancy our chances making it through that. What do you think? Um... I don't... I can't remember how much health we have. Can we hit the bones back? Maybe if we hit the bones hard enough? We have no weapons that could hit them at such distance. How about we fall back for now? I don't like it, but we've no other choice. Let's pull back. <laughs> it really has been one nuisance after another here. I suppose my crushing you will be the last lesson you learn. <laughs> Come to me if you can. I'm going to assume we can't fight him. That damned Zorba. He would go to such lengths to desecrate the royal's legacies. Damn frustrating to get stuck after coming this far. No other paths either. Are we just going to have to charge through? We cannot evade such a barrage. Nor will our armor protect us fully. There has to be a better way. What actually does happen if you don't get up there by the day of calamity? Is your game just fucked? Do you have to, like, do the last five days? If someone sacrificed themselves, surely we run out of bullets, we could use a shield. We could use a shield. Or something close enough to it. A shield? Well, <laughs> for lack of a shield proper, can you think of I mean, she's the like night this? man. A, the painting of Luis. <laughs> the painting of Luis? What? From the portrait hall? Ah, of course. It's pretty big. He might not even want to destroy it. He might actually even look at the painting and be like, shit. If we shield ourselves with Luis's portrait, yeah. he may well refuse to fire upon us. But it's just a flimsy painting. But he's a not going to want to destroy it. That he took the trouble to protect, transport, and mount. If he truly worships Luis, might he not hesitate to shoot it? Point taken. I suppose it's our best shot. That, okay. Oh. What? You degenerates! That! Find <laughs> us. We've rubbish to dispose of. Rubbish! You heathens! I'll pulverize you! Try if you like. Be ashamed to destroy your Lord Luis's pretty face, though. Ah, underhanded, treacherous little! That's rich coming from you. Silence! You witless incompetence. Ah, I can't tarry here any longer. I have important things to do. However, you defile Lord Luis with this, this blasphemy. You'll pay. I swear, I'll make you regret that. We should just carry the painting everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. Oh, so it's desecration when it comes to his Lord, but the sanctity of the dead means nothing. No kidding. We must be getting close. That's pretty funny. Alright. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see. Hold on. Melancholia. 
A word uttered by the necromancer Zorba thought to be an invocation of magic where the magla within one's body irrepressibly bursts, causing biological functions to turn irregular. The, phenomena, the phenomenon drives most creatures to uncontrolled violence and bizarre changes can occur throughout the body, depending on the degree of its progression. Um... Zorba. Sursium? Cursium? Sursium Zorba? Part of the entourage Luis brought with him to the royal funeral. A skilled mage who demonstrated such fanatic loyalty to Luis that he willingly descended into necromancy. His single horn and closed third eye suggests a half-blooded Clemmer and Mustari ancestry. And discrimination he faced for these circumstances likely led to his blind fanaticism. He's a victim to society. Children born to parents of disparate tribes, half-bloods often inherit physical attributes from both tribes, as evidenced by Zorba and Maria. While it is theoretically possible for any of the tribes to bear offspring together, conceiving a child between different tribes is less viable than within the same tribe. Therefore, they are few in numbers. Even in metropolitan areas with diverse populations, those with mixed heritages are rarely to be seen. Half-blood children are often ostracized from both tribes they hail from due to their unnatural appearance. They typically, the typical characteristics they would otherwise inherit from each tribe can be underdeveloped, leading to smaller wings for half-blood Ishkia or singular horns for half-blood Clemmers. They are greatly misunderstood, generally isolated from others, and face unjust social disdain. Did they have another page here? On, uh, on, on... Nope. Necromancer. A man clad in black who appears to be one of Luis's closest aides. Certain physical characteristics of his suggests he's a half-blood, such as a single... Okay, cool, cool, cool. Interesting. Let's see. Oh, this was difficulty. I'm gonna see what easy looks like. Just because... I do kind of just want to play the game for the story. Like, the combat... Oh, where did I just go? The combat is like good, but I feel like uh, when I'm kind of stuck in here fighting for so long, it does definitely get a little bit tiring. I'm well, not tiring, but it's like I I'm, I'm here for the dialogue and stuff. I want to know what happens next. I'm actually curious to see how much easier it makes it though. Like, oh my way, I didn't even know what to do here. I Holy shit. Okay, let's get this all we've got. Okay, uh, yeah, hold on, let's see. Uh, here. 242 damage. Uh, this is yours. I'll cut you down. Dude, I really think. A lot of the challenge comes from managing your MP throughout like a dungeon. I kind of don't want to be managing MP. Um, yes, that's kind of... Um, I mean a little bit. We're actually kind of all good on health. All right, so we found a staircase. How high up does this go? This is... Oh shit, but the seal on the door has been broken. They broke into the royal scepter chamber. But before I go in, is there any loot? Nope. Wait, does that mean they grabbed the royal scepter already? How can they use it though? I thought the king could only use it. The royal scepter? Has he truly taken it? How could he have dispelled those wards alone? No. Even if he has it, we've seen no signs of escape. Were the scepter his only target, he'd not have stayed within. Where'd he go? No one's seen him, so he must still be close by. That's the only other way out, right? If he's gone ahead, he could only be on the roof. But what could he seek there? Dude, There's imagine he turns everyone into zombies. The scepter. Probably that day of calamity he's been raving about. He said we had until the morning is over. We must stop him. All right. Hurry!
Onward. Holy crap, there's a whole other area out here. We out here. Anything down here? Probably not. Holy. Wait. Dude, I actually kind of get like oh, major yeah. AOT vibes. Whoa. The human chilling in the middle there. Even so. She like looks exactly like Shigan Shina. Huh. No. Fair king with a face in the sky to one that'll do my soul like Louise. True. Okay. This is probably the boss. Um, it's probably the boss, and I have no mana. But we'll see if like defeating the boss is feasible with uh. What now? With no mana. Um, I don't think I have anything to give myself. Oh, 50 MP to an ally? Wait, that's actually really good. Okay, that actually might be enough. At last. We're finally here. Zorba should be up ahead. Let's finish this. I right, we'll put a stop to him once and for all. Yeah, like, if I just had to, like, walk through that whole... Like, just go through that little stretch. Literally only come back the next day to beat the boss. That would kind of suck. I think I, I have to learn how to manage my, my mana. All right, let's see what Zorba's doing. Mm, this is the royal scepter, is it? Divine relic, progenitor of all igniters. Now I need only keep it safe until the handover. Trespasser. Oh! The faith of the people doth not lie with thee. Thou art unworthy of the crown's authority. Yo, what the f whoa. Did Until he a worthy successor rises, oh. I shall keep the set. Oh, he's keeping it. I thought he destroyed it. May wield the magic of kings, the true protector of the people. Oh, they kind of just threw that out the window then. All right. <sighs> there you have it. The king will only forfeit the royal scepter to a people's champion. So, no risk of it falling into someone else's hands for now. Meaning Lord Luisa's victory is assured. All that remains is my glorious calamity. Oh, how they will cry when the swell of Magla bursts. How they will beg and crawl and plead for Lord Luisa's salvation. There you are. Where is the royal scepter? The fallen king protects it. The scepter is beyond us all. For the time being, that is. Now, if you're finished, be gone from my sight. I'll not harm you either. Even I have some sympathy for fools. Oh, we'll see ourselves out. Once we knock Luis's whereabouts out of you. I'm sorry. Do you... Do you actually think you can stop me? Ah, uh, let's find out. Why don't we find out? <laughs> Real. <laughs> <laughs> I see now! No wonder I couldn't understand your actions. They're baseless, utterly unfounded. Madness ill becomes you, Zorba. You again. What would you know of it? I know no lady knights. Wait, a knight with blood red tresses. Don't tell me you're the buffoon who failed to protect the prince. Oh. Judgments mean nothing from a man who sullies the dead. You've fallen far yourself. Perhaps I am unworthy of the royal scepter. But I can still bring change to this world. I can still teach them true fear. You'll find that hard to do from a dungeon, blackguard. The time has come for you to face justice. You, knight, have no idea what real justice is. And that mistake will cost you your life. Rejoice, rats. That willless assassin is dead. <laughs> but I shall gladly send you to join him. <laughs> Rejoice, rats is crazy. All right. Now die. Lord Luis's destined kingdom will be built atop your bones. What destined kingdom? Tell us where Luis has gone, or we'll tear the words from you. For all the innocent lives you played for pawns, I shall make you pay. We don't stop. All right. There's no telling how. Ah, uh, he's definitely weak to 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 light. Oh, I don't have a light. Big attack. Power of light. 
Is he not weak to light? Oh, is he just weak to nothing? Rider of the Blade. I guess I guess it's probably worth me figuring out what he's actually weak to, even though I got a shit ton of MP. Oh, critical, alright. I'm gonna draw his uh attack to me. I call upon royal power within. Oh, okay. Corpse puppetry. <laughs> I mean, did Galakon really not like pick that up? Of course he has the power to control the dead. Alright, this is actually pretty chill. This might actually be like a little bit too easy. Maybe I'll go easy up all the way until the bosses, and then for the bosses I have I have like, you know, her resources ready. I'll just have to do it the other way around for all the other bosses. Um wait, this is kinda bad. Hold on. Then we go with this. It's getting weaker. Um 100 HP to all allies. I probably only need... Yeah, let's do that. that helped. Helpful as ever. Yeah, it's not bad. In the no holding back. Oh, holy light. By this power. Uh, still up? Okay. I pull your strings. Is that all? That pretty chill. Nice. Right there. What is he weak to? Maybe it's actually weak to win. Always resist and holy shit. What's up, Ems? Yeah, he's got have a Scottish accent. It actually kind of doesn't suit him at all, honestly. I wasn't, uh, was not... Honestly, he killed off one of our other Scottish-sounding friends. And then he comes in sounding Scottish. So I, I just reckon they wanted to, uh have another Scottish motherfucker in the game. Okay, I'm gonna... Perfect punch him. Miss? Scottish beef. How have you been today, man? Oh, what the fuck? I think we're chilling. Oh, actually, yeah, my teammate is... Wait, my, my main guy's fucked up right now. Can I hit an arc? No, we're not gonna archetype. Oh, again, I don't have a heal ability, though. That's what <gasps> oh, I just auto-battled. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Did not mean to auto-battle. I'm gonna heal myself. I watched him off like a run from the cops right in front of it. Wait, really? He needs some wet fuck. When this would be good. Dude, I've been feeling like junk food so bad lately. Oof. Okay. Alright. Let's see. Impossible. Oh, this is gonna second phase. Lord Luis! Oh, okay, okay. Satisfactory. Yeah, I'll take that. I'll take that, honestly. Is that increased? Thank you. I'm just going to keep doing item luck. I just want more items. Hoping it gives me mana items. You have desecrated the cathedral. You have plundered graves. You have taken innocent lives. Stand, fiend, and face your sentence. Don't kill him yet. He needs to tell us where Luis is. You'll get nothing from me. Just end it and be done. You know Luis won't return that loyalty. Once you outlive your usefulness, he'll cast you aside. Lord Luis is everything to me. How could I expect the damned Clamart to understand what it's like? You... You must know. Surely an elder like you must know what it's like. To be an outcast. To be every fool's scapegoat. 
They call us lesser tribes. They loathe us. Their speeches of tribal harmony mean nothing when every day they cheat and abuse us. Do you think I didn't believe once? That I never dared to hope my efforts made me equal? Then I heard exactly what they think of us. The lessers are expendable. Send them to the fore, and they shall be our living shields. They doomed us, and laughed as we died. But these atrocities make you no better than your oppressors. You know, it's a curious thing. They say Magla is born from pain and negative emotions. Magic is a dangerous art, isn't it? What's he gonna do? Is he about to do something crazy? An unstoppable swell of Magla, but it doesn't matter anymore. Those lordly pigs can drown in their own dread. Sanctism cannot save this world. If we are to be ruled by a god, then let it be Lord Luis. <laughs> what the fuck did he just do? Did just do? Yeah, real. What, what did he just this do? This is everything I've been building my magla for. A little early, perhaps. But now, you can experience my glorious day. Of calamity! Hey, tell us where Luis is! Ah, my lord. <gasps> Luis. Holy shit! Damn it! Eerie Raw? Did he just turn into something? What's happening? This feels like. <gasps> it's, it's a human! Did he turn into a human? Yeah. Wait. He brought it back to life? Wait. Wait, what did he do? A human? Wait. Is it that monstrosity? <gasps> oh my god, he brought that shit world? back to life. It wasn't is, dead? is that what the calamity was? That was Zorba's gift, wasn't it? Animation. Reanimation. A gigantic human is wreaking havoc in Grand Trad. At this rate, Zorba's scheme to unleash the day of calamity will come true. Monster breaches the city. We have to help. We have to get down there and help. The place is collapsing. Hurry! Yo, those kind of cooked. Necromancer takedown. Zorba the Necromancer used the last of his power to reanimate the human corpse and fell from the roof of the Grand Cathedral. Thwart Zorba's plan. Bro, but th then what? We finally made it to the bottom. That was a hell of a collapse. Zorba's spell practically took the whole place down. What a mess. Look. Should I have spoken to more people down the bottom? Should lead to the cathedral's oh. plaza. Brilliant. Let's stop that monster. Damn it. Okay, but I don't have to fight anything now. Are you see, I'm in no state to fight. I'm in no state to fight at all. Record my journey. Yep. It says it's finished recording. Well, I saved, right? Wait, I literally just saved, but I'm just, I'm fucking paranoid that it didn't go through. All right, I might, um, yep. I might honestly end the VOD there, man. That was, that was kind of cooked. Uh, I am going to fix my cam though. My cam has been, uh, has been trolling this whole time with the outro intro. Um, that was freaking dope. Uh, I need to edit these VODs together. I'm going to combine the last two VODs because it was way too much combat. And it's about six hours of footage. So I'll condense it down to about like three hours maybe. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed that. It's getting good. It's... Uh, I, I don't... Dude, that human is going to be cooked. That was a really big human that they had down there. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you.